Hello? And to whom this may concern? Or should I say hello again? Because I was just on for 12 hours. Just recently. And I'm back again. Because it's time to finish Danganronpa. Oh, well, I finished Danganronpa, but... It's time to finish grinding Danganronpa's school mode. Gotta do it. Gotta finish grinding. Is the Elgato working? Is there audio? Let me double check. Nope. I think that fixes it. Where the hell's my mouse? Oh, good. Fixed. Nice. Alright. There's no point in dawdling around. There's lots to do. There's some grinding to be done. This is one hell of a bonus stream right now. Sleepless, even. Can chair? Come on. Bit me in there. There we go. Bashing my whole desk. Okay. Thrills, chills. No, <laughs> shush. You stupid bear. All right. Out to date, somebody. Shit. How many days do I have? Does it tell me? It does not. That's odd. Um, let's see. Report card. Hmm. How far we get with Chihiro? Just one. Hmm. Chihiro was one. Celeste got to four. I could finish Celeste off really quick, actually. Hi, Aquadran. Early in the morning. <laughs> Where is Celeste? Celeste? Baby girl? Oh, there she is. Behind the fat guy. Okay. Three AM gamers. Oh, is it three AM where you are, Aqua? Well, I um, I streamed for twelve hours up until eight AM, all night, and I took a two-hour break to go have breakfast, and I'm back again. I'm doing some grinding. Oh, hi, Genie, again as well. <laughs> <laughs> See, I wasn't gone for too long. Um, maybe I should trip ticket somebody. Hmm. I still got time. Hang on. Too legit to quit. Have you ever seen? Have you ever seen? Um. Oh, fuck, what was it called? What's the um, Andy Samberg movie? Where he's the stuntman? Hot Rod? Where they do the too legit to quit bit? Ah, oh, damn. That's probably the best um, skit I've ever seen any comedian do. About over the too le legit to quit thing. Fuck, I can't even remember how to do it. I don't want to, I don't want to bastardize it. But if you're ever on YouTube, look up Hot Rod Too Legit to Quit. Um, let's see. What do I need? The door. 
Da -da. Loving gifts, Byakugan. No. No. Son of a bitch. Okay, the students that you guaranteed one heart per trip, including Sakura like before, and there's a group of students where it's very hard to get one heart per trip and they might take longer. Celeste is one of them. Awful sign language. Who's doing awful sign language? Wait, are you, t are you talking about the... Um... The bit? Yeah, okay. <laughs> I forgot that they use their hands to sign it. I just remember the, like... The whole, like... Um... Now I'm not legit, so I must quit. <laughs> he keeps twisting the sentence. That's a weird movie. Like, there's some parts of that movie that are funny, and there's some parts that are just plain straight weird. Like, they do a riff on Cool Beans as well. Like, you know how people sometimes say Cool Beans? And it makes almost no sense at all. Um. Okay. Let's spend time with Celeste. How, how about... There is nothing to be done. Come on, a boat, motherfucker. Oh, um, what's their band called again? Andy Sandberg and the other two. God, why can't I remember? That did on the um on a boat, Lonely Island. Yes, man, I'm forgetting a lot of things right now just through pure tiredness. I've got two of their albums, I think, downloaded. On my PC. They get a lot of good um, celebs featuring. Like Justin Timberlake was on a couple of their songs. Uh, Akon was on the I Just Had Sex song. They've had Rihanna, I think. Three, yeah. One of them was um, Jizz in My Pants. That was one of the uh, Justin Timberlake songs. Oh yeah, Shy Ronnie. No, yeah, Jizz in My Pants is one of the Lonely Island songs that had Justin Timberlake in it. The one that was ripping off like uh, UK techno songs. Although we're starting to get our wires crossed a bit with um, the Lonely Island SNL skits and the Lonely Island like actual music. Because I know Shy Ronnie has music in it, but that was like an SNL digital short. Whereas they've got actual album music, which includes I'm on a boat, the I just had sex and the jizz in my pants. The Shy Ronnie bits are hilarious though. I like both of them. But the second one's the best. The one in the bank. Where they bring in the actor John Hamm from Mad Men. And she like grabs him and takes him out at the end. Hello, Celeste. I got her to level 4, I think, already. So, this should go very quick. I haven't seen the video. Oh, they're worth it. Both the Shy Ronnie skits on YouTube are worth it. They're so funny. Um, let me just find Celeste in my cheat sheet real quick. I initially went in here to do that, and I distracted by something else. There she is. So I think two more levels with her. I'm almost finished. Rose Hip Tea. A Zol Diamond Antique Doll Love Status Ring. Love Status Ring. Let's give her that. I need to let her, let her know about my love status. You've only seen I'm on a boat and I just had sex, that's all I remember. 
even though it sounds gross, the uh, jizz in my pants music video is actually really funny. Oh, Natalie Portman rap, yeah, also good. There's two of those, isn't there? There's a rap too as well. I think I've seen them both. I've definitely heard them both. Pretty sure I've seen both the videos. <laughs> Second one was much later. Oh, they went back. They went back in a long time later. I wonder why they went back in for seconds, after so much time. It's not like Natalie Portman's celebrity went... Actually, she disappeared for quite a while. I didn't I didn't see her in anything for uh, ages until she came back for Thor again. Um, Love and Thunder. As for me... Oh, she was pregnant? I had no idea. I really didn't. Hello, Makoto. I must say, I'm quite troubled. Indeed. I'd like you to teach me something. Ooh, this... This is starting off quite, uh, steamy. Actually... I want you to teach me how to play shogi. Honestly. You really are useless, aren't you? No, what? I don't know how to play shogi either. I don't even know what shogi is. Oh. Wait. There's a gambling circuit for this game, Shogi. How does she not already know it? She's the ultimate gambler. Indeed. It's all underground. They removed some verses. Andy said she, he didn't blame her because they went crazy. Oh, so they basically ride it as hard as they can, and they just let Natalie decide what's too far. Are you okay with this? This is why I wish to learn. I place my pieces without even thinking. What on earth am I doing? So she tried to win a... Oh, she did win a Shogi tournament, even though she didn't know what she was doing. Wow. Maybe she's the ultimate luck student. Hmm. I didn't really understand, but apparently my final opponent was infamously powerful. She was rather odd. She was a voluptuous woman who dressed as an exotic French maid. That's you. <laughs> what the hell? I think she crimped this woman's style. Beginner's luck. <laughs> Is that so? The more about to learn about Celeste, the less I understand her. She's a wacky. She's a little wacky. I think one more date will do it though. I feel like there's a weird crossover between um Celeste and uh, um, Makoto. This is a school and because the ultimate luck student and the ultimate gambling student are almost the same thing, conceptually. <laughs> Isn't that wonderful? He's giving me another cheat sheet? See ya. You beauty. That is, that is lucky. Who's getting it? Who's getting it? Uh... Shit, wait. Oh, um... Junko has increased herself to five somehow, on her own. Without me having to increase it for her. Amazing. I'm gonna go to six. Makoto's going to six. I wanna be the first to six. You don't need luck when you game the system. No, but like that that example from that previous conversation was that she didn't even know how to play Shogi and she entered the tournament anyway and she just placed the pieces at random, not knowing what she was doing, and she still somehow beat some woman that was like the greatest in Japan at it. So Celeste clearly has some kind of luck thing going on, just like me. Although she really is the true ultimate luck student, because um, as we found out from the end of the game, Makoto is actually the ultimate hope student, so...
She noticed what the other people were doing and quickly figured it out. I wouldn't say figured it out. She might have subconsciously read them in some way, but she still doesn't actually know how to play it because that's why she was just asking me to teach her how Shogi works. Um, so on a conscious level, she still doesn't really understand the rules. But as a gifted gambler, she would know how to read humans. So there, uh, there at least was some of that going on. Uh, we're done here, so consumables. Photo album, electronic table. Got it. Oh, I'm blue. Alright, go to bed. Go to bed. Go to bed. Go to bed. light. Wait, what was it? Photo album electronic table, yeah. Sorry, mental blank. Okay. Oranges. You're gonna go for photo album. It's going to be a lot of you. Um, if you're red, we're going to go for electronic table, which is the data center. Center. Library. 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 Wait, we need more cleaning. We got two. Ooh, 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 ooh. Celeste, you're back on cleaning duty. Yeah, there we go. That's the game. Let's go. Shift. Cool. Okay. Photo album one. Jesus Christ, it's hard to find those. Didn't get any of the electronic tables. They're both such a pain. What would you like to do? Meet with someone. I wonder how I accidentally clicked on, um... Um... Don't spend my free time. The previous time. I don't know how I did that. Celeste! Hey, baby. I like your red eyes. They're very evil. There is nothing to be done. Okay. Present, yes. Okay. Let's try Antique Doll Rose Whip. I've got two. Alright. That's the one. <laughs> Look how quickly we have become close friends, Makoto. Indeed. Let me share with you something. It's my titty. Please place it in mouth. I will tell you about the biggest crisis I ever faced in my gambling life. Oh. Is this going to be some, like, pr problem with the mob where you almost got concrete chewed into a river? A shadowy organization was hosting a mysterious tournament. A game in which I participate was called King of Liars. 
Are you it was okay quite a this? severe game. When you enter, they strip you of your assets, money, property, everything. You must use your wisdom, cunning, and luck to battle through challenge after challenge. For the final match, I had to face off with Odd Duo. They call themselves Honest Woman and Liar Genius. Actually... During break, I was careless and spilled some tea on my clothes. I was terrified the stain would never come out. That was a very difficult time in my life. That was the difficult part? Honestly. I was forced to win more quickly than I wanted so I could rush to the cleaners. I was able to get the stain out, but it was perilously close. <sighs> if I'd waited even another hour, I would have been forced to throw out my favorite dress. Wow. So I'm sure the actual gambling part of the game was no problem. I got menacing focus, and that's still not the end of her. I think it's of the day. Okay, Mo, Moe Moe Kuma, built. Oh, it's a, it's a monokuma with little fairy wings. This is Moe. Hmm. It's got a certain cuteness, I guess, but something about it is off. It's wrong. Yes, Do it indeed. over. It is a total failure. Did you know, take me finishing your assignment? So I guess I'll give you some do? more tickets. He never likes any of the fucking robots I build for him. Why does he even leave us to do it? If he's never happy with it. The next concept is the Monokuma Adult. Or the Monokuma Adult. As it were. Seven days. Okay. And Kyoko's feeling mighty jazzed up for the day's work. The Monokuma Adult. Five Greek statues, 20 stainless steel sheetings, power saws, step ladders, syringe. Jesus. What's it like being an adult? It's like dying. <laughs> Alright. Interesting. Five Greek statues. One, two, three, four, five. Done. Stainless steel sheeting. Power saw. Oh god, I need lots of cardboard. And tree branches. What else? Step ladder syringe. Oh, fuck. Well, there's one stainless steel sheeting. Tree branch? Cardboard are the biggest problems. And syringe. Tree branch, cardboard, and syringe. Let's see. Tree branch, cardboard. This syringe. Step ladder, tree branch. A lot of these are going to be in the triple down HPs. I didn't know Andy could backflip in a skirt. Oh, is that from Shy Ronnie? Cardboard. Cardboard should be easy to get because that is not one of the rare items from that location. It's just in a very large HP loss location. Okay. I'm gonna go here. Little plate, aluminum can. I can probably send the yellows to here without losing anybody. Go for the syringes. Um, 
I need more cleaners. I'm duty. You go to bed. Only, uh, Junko's going to bed today. John Hammer, such a dorky look on his face. He was being dragged off by, um, sexy gangster Rihanna, though, so... Uh, I'm gonna give him a pass on the- on the dorky face. I'd probably be pulling the same face. Thought it was cute. <laughs> Um, I guess you go for cardboard. Syringe. Syringe. Eh, this is quite tricky. Oh, what about Fat Boy? Uh, you also go for cardboard. This one's gonna be a bit messy, I think. Okay. Didn't think an actor of his stature would be willing to do something like that. Um, I don't know how high his stature was when he did Shy Ronnie, though. It might have been long enough ago that he hadn't been in as many, like, big stuff. Like, that might have been pre-Madman, or like, right in the middle of it, as his star was still rising. I know he's been around for longer than that, but not as, like, a huge deal actor. Two cardboard. Two step ladder. Ten syringe. Okay, that went really well. Not bad. Halfway through, but then he was big. He'd probably just started to become big, so he was just throwing himself into all kinds of like fun shit that he could do. Because that's, I think that's around about when everyone starts reaching out to you for stuff like that. Once you're big for long enough, I think you probably get tired of it all, and you start to get more picky again. Um, I guess I'm still celesting. Hi, Sham. As for me. Ah, <sighs> okay. This should be the last one for Celeste. Give me the press. Press. What would you like to give her? Let's go see how many rose whips I've got. Where's the whip? Where is it? Rose whip. Oh, I don't have any. Uh, antique doll. Zol diamond. Zol diamond. I may not have that. Love status ring. Rose hip tea. Rose hip tea. There you go. <sighs> He's just an awesome, humble dude. He seems like he would be. No one ever has a bad thing to say about John Ham. The way you said that concerns me, that was like, oh no, here comes trouble, hey Sham. <laughs> I don't think that was the intention. Hmm. Mr. Makoto, uh, N-word. I was hoping we could talk, just the two of us. Come to my room, please. Heyo! Hi, Sharkle. I'm still here. Indeed. Everyone just, yeah, everyone just kind of floated back. 
We're going to Celeste's room. Hell yeah. I did what Celeste asked and headed to her room right away. I am wow, so this happy. place is funky. She has a chandelier. And a crown. I am glad you came, Makoto. Hmm. She wants me to help test her range of butt plugs. Actually. I received the results. <sighs> the child Greg in my belly, it's yours. <laughs> Excuse me? No. <laughs> we did not do this. Wait, sorry, wrong results. <laughs> okay, so who's whose child? <laughs> you have moved up a rank, you are now C rank. C rank in what friendship? Actually. I have a habit of ranking those around me. The most common is D. I have no interest in D. Oh, I was really hoping you'd have interest in the D. Damn. Vitamin D rank. I wonder what the hell she meant by that. I hope that baby thing was just a joke. Unless she actually did mix up her results and there is someone else that um, is having her baby. Most everyone in this school fits into that category. The worst is F rank. If you're F rank... Every time I, I go to read F rank, I almost say Frank. If you get to F rank, I pay a special organization to have you killed. Your very existence is unforgivable. <laughs> I don't actually know when she's joking or not, because she doesn't really seem like the type to joke. Or at least doesn't actually put on any kind of joking tone of voice. Among everyone I have met across all countries, I have never met or found a B rank, let alone A. This is fine. So being promoted to C is a very great honor. She has very high standards, <laughs> almost impossibly. When you become C, you gain the right to become my official servant, the knight. I don't know if that's such a good, a good position. Indeed. I have knights all across the world. They are very obedient. Okay. She's the reverse Toko. Like, Toko wants to be someone's servant. Celeste wants servants. Of men. Could it be? I feel you may have the potential. I have the potential for A rank? Damn, Skippy. Although... Junko seems to think I'm an Omega, so... I don't know. <laughs> Please be prepared to give your life for me. I am not. In fact, I'm so unprepared to give my life for you, I uh, busted you in the class trial and got you killed in an execution. Spoilers! I guess that's the end of her arc. Cleared the 30 SP threshold. Ghostface Skiller. What an awesome name for an achievement! <laughs> Ghostface Skiller. <laughs> That's awesome. Ah, <laughs> uh, tickled. Yes, we know, Bear. We don't need you. We are busy. Oh, it's Sunday again. Yes, indeed. Now then. Well, that means two free times. Um, hmm. He loves Celeste's accent. How do you know what her accent sounds Oh, wait, she does actually talk in the game. I just do a bastardized version of it. Oh, the creep. That was the one um, that Nicki Minaj was in with them, right? And also John Waters appears in like a cameo at the end. That's what bastardized means, Genie. Um, fuck who- I love John Waters. Who the fuck is John Waters? He's the guy that appears- the creepy guy that appears at the start of the end of the video. He's a movie director, he's um, responsible for Pink Flamingos, Crybaby, 
a bunch of other counterculture movies during that period. Who is he, period? You don't know John Waters? He's made some pretty famous movies. Um, why can I only remember Cry Baby and Pink Flamingos? Pink Flamingos was the controversial one. All his um, films had like a very counterculture kind of vibe to them. He made movies for the, the weirdos and the freaks. That was his whole thing. Cry Baby. Oh, the original Hairspray. That was him. Not the John Travolta uh, newer one. The one that was based on. Back in 1988. Cecil B. Demented. I remember that. That's a very straight to, to VHS type movie. Polyester. That's pretty famous. There's Pink Flamingos. He's a weird man. But quite the auteur. And that's why he shows up in the music video for Freak. <laughs> I mean, Creep. I thought bastard eyes were the eyes you can't see on the hentai protagonist. Best joke I've made all year. Oh, bastard eyes. As in the thing that I said. I was like, wait, what's he referring to? I see what you did there. Oh, what am I doing now? I should probably line somebody else up for the end of the game. You know what? Since we just did Celeste for the report card, let's trip ticket her. What's her shit? School mode location, dining hall. Oh, the very first one. Hentai protags are sometimes known as ugly bastards. It is weird how often um, the male a uh, male characters in hentai are gross. I don't know what the deal with that is. Oh, okay. Wait. Uh, how do you get to here to do that? Oh, it's uh. What do you call it? It's extensions. Pack lunch and go somewhere? No, she wouldn't like that. What do you like to do at night? Oh shit. Oh shit. So these two are zero hearts. This one at the bottom is a 0 0.5. I accidentally got a combination that doesn't allow me to get a full heart. That sucks. Let's see. I spent most evenings alone in my room, reading and drinking tea. Luckily, there are not enough books here that I don't think I will ever run out. Oh! In case you were wondering, this is black tea. Are you okay with this? Contrary to what you might imagine, I'm not fond of oolong or green tea. Okay! Hmm. Well, that's it. These bit, these are usually very short, these dates. You never understood the whole ugly bastard trend. Maybe it appeals to um, the lowest common denominator of hentai fan. Like, the assumption is, I guess, if we make the storylines about an ugly, hideous, kind of gross person um, hooking up with the cutest, most gorgeous anime girls, then, like, every guy out there that is gross and ugly that can't get real women will be more into our hentai. Maybe it's something like that. I'm just guessing, though. He's the guy. Yes, John Waters is the one that appears on the TV. That was like the biggest, that was the first thing I noticed in that trailer, because I knew John Waters very well. <sighs> Sorry, in that music video. <laughs> I hate that that only gave me 0 0.5 stars. She's going to take a bit longer to do if she keeps doing that to me.
You, um, I'm not sure if you've ever heard of it or not, but Pink Flamingos um, was quite notorious back in the 80s for being like kind of gross. Like there's a scene where uh, this crossdresser named Divine, I can't remember why it happens, but she, she picks up one of those like, you know those dog poos that are like white for some reason? She picks one up one of those in the lawn and she eats it. And um, the behind the scenes um, rumor that got around was the actor, actress, I'm not actually sure what the pronouns of that person was, uh, did it for real. And I think it might have been a an improv that John Waters really liked. He knew John Waters very well. What is he? He waters the culture, Sham. Um, I better keep doing this. I don't like how she's going to drag this out, but now that I've started, I'm going to see it through. Please give me one where I can get a full heart, girl. Please. Fuck, she did it again. Alright, so out of two sessions with her, I only got one full heart, because they were both a half a heart each. That sucks. Hmm. <laughs> well, I'm committed now. We'll get her there. Yeah, since I, um, I've only got uh, <laughs> Sakura completed up to heart level 10 prepared for the end of the game um, so I thought I might I better start getting someone else up to heart level 10 and since I just finished um, Celeste report card I thought she might be I might as well just stay on her this monokuma adult toy is gonna be such a pain stainless steel power saw Cardboard tree branch. I need the cardboard and the tree branch more than anything right now. Or I'm going to be in trouble. Let's see. Who wants to go to bed? Nobody? We're all good? Amazing. Cardboard. Tree branch. I say we need to do these two. But not if you lot are going to be in orange. That worries me. Okay. Just a cleaner over here. That looks good. Who else? You two gonna clean? Okay, good. You're back. Good. We're gonna put you on cardboard. You're going on cardboard. Cardboard. Okay. That's gonna have to do. Go. You're going to be very tired. Yeah. Can't be helped. I'm going to fall asleep while streaming and wake up. What? I'm going to fall asleep on this stream and wake up during the other stream? Hey, we found four cardboards. That was actually not bad. Syringe. Step ladder. Check the meter. Now then. 
Hey, Sakura and uh, Celeste are right next to each other. Cool. Well, she said it to I'm just sleeping. Keep the stream on. Do they actually have a category for the the sleep streams? They had they made a category for that. That's nuts. Please give me something good, Celeste. Yes, here we go. For breakfast, Japanese style is best. That'll give me a full heart. Yep, nice. <laughs> I've seen VTubers doing the sleep. Oh man. Really? Okay, that's cheating. The v that VTuber sleep thing is cheating, because a, a 3D animated character with a looping sound effect isn't isn't sleeping. My day begins with jam or butter on a freshly baked baguette and a cafe au lait, <sighs> pickled vegetables and miso soup. Last thing I want in the morning. <laughs> Gyoza is allowed. The irresistible crude fragrance is most refreshing. I didn't actually ask. That was too much information. <laughs> I might do it legitimately. But what's the point almost of sleeping um. as a VTuber? I mean, you're not even on camera. Let's do it! Hey, Leon's fired up. <laughs> Isn't that non bean. See? I got the non <laughs> I got that hilarious non senzu beam. Restores consciousness. Okay, so if I lose, if someone gets knocked out, I have a way to bring them back. It's pretty good. I mean, I feel like you wouldn't do it if you knew that you sleep talk. That would be too risky. Something weird might happen. Okay, stainless steel sheeting. Bam, bam. I'm still... Struggling with this tree branch. That's scary. Please, people, find me tree branch. Now everyone's falling asleep. Oh my god. What a nightmare. Okay, you... Shit. Tree branch. Tree branch. I'm... Even though it's a... It's a three down HP. I'm gonna leave... I'm gonna leave myself... Mikado on the tree branch search and I'm going to see if the triple down HP hurts me at yellow if I've got a level 6 in scavenger. If it does, I can use that item to bring myself back from the dead. Tree branch. Mikado avocado. cleaners do I have? Just the two? That's fine. This is not a great day. C 
six tree branches. That was not bad, actually. That turned itself around. Okay. Back to Celeste. I like how quickly these can go through. It's good for grinding. And I know I'm not missing anything because it's always the same dialogue. For breakfast, Japanese style is best. Once again, full heart. So she's up to three. Sakura, fire it up. <sighs> Power saw. One, two, three, and two. Fuck, that's bad. I'm actually really scared about this one. What are the odds I'm going to be able to make th another 17 stainless steel sheetings and another 18, no, another 8 power saws in time? These tree branches and these cardboards are killing me. To... Sham, it's 2023. You got the year wrong. Go to bed. Okay, so I didn't get... I didn't pass out. I think Genie was right about the scavenge level decreasing how much the HP down hurts you. That's handy. you guys. I'm gonna need you all on cardboard duty. Any thinks? Oh yeah, go nuts. You're on cleaning duty? Okay, good. Two cleanings. Three cleanings. Sleep, sleep, sleep. Everyone's going to the gym today. Look for cardboard. Why would there be cardboard? Random cardboard in the gym. <laughs> Gotta stop dolling in the past, man. I'm I'm the one reminding you that it's the future. What do you mean I'm dwelling in the past? I know it's 2023. I'm trying to help you. Um Yeah, all right, we're good. Yep, all right, we're good. I'm just paranoid. Go, 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 go. Eight cardboards, not bad. Not a bad day's work. Now's not the time to go into details of who was bringing up the wrong year. Definitely wasn't me. There is a stream VOD that we can um, we can access and clip. Hey, Celeste. I know I've been hounding you every day, but it's gonna keep happening until you give me your love.
Ah, oh, not this again. That's the 0 0.5 one. That's the half a heart. Hmm, pain. Pain in my butthole. Hero, just feeling antsy today. How'd we go? Stainless steel sheeting. Boom, boom. I still need 15 of those. Christ. How long have I got? Two days! Oh! I don't want to interrupt the stream. We're going to get the sperm cells in there. There is no way Celeste is going to hook up with Makoto. No way at all. Makoto just doesn't have it in him. He doesn't have that power. Okay, I think I pumped a bunch of uh, resources into stainless steel sheets that I'm not going to be able to spend. That's rough. I mean, I'll, I'll keep shooting for it, but I think I'm kind of screwed. I think it's okay if you miss some of these, though. As long as you get the... The last one done, I think that's how it works. Oh, damn, he's fired up. Right, you two clean. With her. You go back to searching for crap. We'll go for tree branches today. Uh, tree branches. Nutty. Okay. Oh. I pictured an interesting scenario between Celeste and Mikado. Interesting is one way to say it. The RNG gods are jerks when it comes to this game a little bit. Ten tree branches is pretty good. One more day. I'm definitely not going to make it. I'm going to have to let this Makoto doll go. I think all the ones leading up to the final are just to make trip tickets. I think I just have to make sure I'm ready for the final. If I want to actually complete this mode. To your RNG, Jesus, bless us with the Well, it's a bit late for that. He's already betrayed me. Whoa, what? Whoa, whoa, what's going on? Affirmation, negation. This is different. Uh, affirmation to weak spot statement 2. So I could change between affirmation and negation? Okay. Think I'm weird. Can negate that. But I think it's saying the best thing to do is to affirm her second weak spot. Oh, 
Once I've achieved my dreams, reached my goals, hit my quota in life. Stand by my side. Affirmation. I got it. Yeah! I will stand by your side forever, Celeste! I'm your man! Let's see. Um. Oh! Do you have any actual reason to be so confident? <laughs> it is you, of course you don't. What is that supposed to mean? <laughs> if you are truly committed, then I am prepared to accept the commitment. Did I win? This never happened with Sakura. <laughs> I fired affirmation. It was super effective. This is fine. How many hearts did I get for that? Didn't even tell me. I hope that was a full heart. Or maybe even more. Um, this is a school announcement. Why is this music playing? Who knows? Days left one. I'm fucked. I'm gonna stop making power swords and stainless steel butcher majiggers. Three, fours. Yeah, no. Just in case it ends up being a waste. Okay. Let's just go for it. Sleep. 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 Makoto. Stay on those tree branches, I guess. Leave those three on cleaning. Where are you going? More tree branch. Sleep. 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 So normal after not sleeping? I don't know about normal. I <laughs> uh, got a couple of recipe books. Those are pretty rare. Kitchen knife's not bad. Not seeing any tree branches there, or not enough of them. Last, I'm coming. Trip ticket, dining hall, skip dialogue. Say the same thing every goddamn day. Yes, that's a full heart. I don't know why there has to be RNG on those um, conversation choices. Which ones you actually get to pick from. Because sometimes the RNG gets you stuck with choices that don't give you any uh, full heart options. It's just lame. Oh no! Well, I'm fucked. Let's see what he does. I've never had him get mad at me. This is unacceptable. You better start talk taking this seriously. I know you can do better than this. Anyone could. Okay. Well, that's all he's had to say about it. The next concept is... Heavy Arms Monokuma. Heavy Arms Monokuma. Cool. 
Isn't that wonderful? Spirit bomb. See? Thanks, my man. What what does that do? Grants hyper energy for the next assigned task. Cool. What is this thing you've asked me to make? Microchips, iron plates, gas burners, welders. Jesus Christ. Iron plates were good, but microchip, gas burner, welder. Gas burner? Welder. Christ, on a cracker. <sighs> spirit bomb does it take five episodes to- Oh, that's spirit bomb. <laughs> the Dragon Ball. I hope not. I need to- I need to work immediately. 20, 30, and 30. That's a lot of those things to make. Bunsen burners. Lots of. Metal plates, integrated circuits. Bunsen burner, metal plate, integrated circuit. Bunsen burner, metal plate. Bunsen burner, metal plate. There's integrated circuit. Oh shit. Physics lab's got heaps. Okay. Everyone that's red, you're going for integrated circuits in the data center. How about that? What a plan. Everyone that's yellow are going to the physics lab for everything else. You're going to bed. Data center, data center, data center, sleep, 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 physics lab, no, wait, you're a cleaner, okay, cool. Three cleaners. That's good. Ooh, beat it up. Two integrated circuits out of all that. One Bunsen burner. Two metal plates. You guys could have done better than that, surely. Food here is really good. That's one heart. Yes, indeed. Hmm. Who is preparing these meals for us? It is Monokuma. He is truly high quality piece of machinery. But to use such technology on cooking. <laughs> Actually, I'm fine with that. The fine meal helps expand this all. She had fun. Good. Give me that heart. Oh, it's holiday. That means I get two free times today. It's Celeste, double Celeste time. Five again. Let's see. Oh. Mm. Oh boy. Where's she at? How close are we? Now. 
Oh, damn. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Three well? more. Not bad. Oh shit, this again? Oh, it's gonna be the same thing. Uh, hit her with the affirmation... ...on the second thing she says. I think I'm weird, no. That's the one. I got it. Did you hit Toko with deny? Um, I've never done that with Toko before. I haven't gone on any um, day trips with her, but I have a feeling that if I ever get that mini game with Toko, it's probably gonna be exactly what you said. <laughs> Between affirmation and negation, it's gonna be like negating something she says to insult her, and she'll love it. I can almost guarantee that. Day 36. I feel. I don't care, Fatso. How are we going with these welders? I can make at least six of them. I can make three gas burners. Eight of these. Good lord, I need a lot more than that. I'm going to focus on Bunsen's and... Integrated circuits are fine. Bunsen's... Oh, I need them for both. Oh, shit. Okay. Bunsen's integrated circuits are the, the usual. All right. Nobody needs sleep. Everyone is pretty jazzed today. That's awesome. I need y'all to all go to the computer room. How about that? Except for a couple of apples, and the cleaner's doing the usual junk. Two, six, six, three, five. Actually, you know what? Let's only have two cleaners. You also go to the data center. Big data center day. <sighs> 15 integrated circuits. That's all. If I get full hearts, it'll only take two more of these on Celeste. One more upgrade and got a plus 15 greatsword. Um, Elden Ring? Is plus 15 the highest? I remember in one of the older Dark Souls games, I think plus 5 was like the highest you can get. Yes, that's a plus 1. Japanese style is best. Fuck yeah. <laughs> it's almost there. It's to, uh... Plus 25 in Elden Ring. Jesus. <laughs> Rejoice, commoners. Ego Boy is here.
bag of screws. The Bunsen burner is betraying me. Go to sleep, please. Alright, motherfuckers. We're going for Bunsen burners. All of y'all. Bunsen. Bunsen. You can stay up here. Bunsen. Bunsen. Alright, yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, 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 of all the people that were just in the lab, we only got three Bunsen burners? Are you fucking kidding me? What is wrong with all of you? Elden Ring is open world, it's bigger than past games. What, that's why the... The uh, level cap of the weapons is bigger. I mean, I guess that's common sense. Nice. Three, six, nine. Okay, we're on nine with Celeste. We need one more. Well, please give me a one heart. If you give me two one, uh, two point fives, I'm gonna be pissed off. Yeah, it's ten. It's ten hearts, and then the eleventh square is just the little podium that the character stands in. No, <laughs> you fucking bitch. RNG gods have not blessed me today. That's the 0 0.5 heart. If that was a 1, I would have done it. That means I have to come back and do it again. Let's see. Oh. Reload. Oh, well, I don't have a save there. Are you Maybe that is worth doing. Mm. It'll be a bit of a pain, but... That it's save time. Especially with characters like her, where this can happen. According to this list, half the characters, there'll always be an option to give you one heart. But then the other half of the characters, there's RNG on sometimes only getting a, one, a 0 0.5 option and then a couple of zeros. So those are the characters that um, it might be best to save scum. See? What did you just give me? I forgot to check. I think it was a sandwich. Oh my god, everyone's tired today. Whoa. Whoa. Grant hyper energy for the next task. Yeah, do it. Me. Bam. Fair amount of HP. Give it to her. Sakura, you're pretty good. That's probably good enough. Yeah, I've used up most of my drugs and sandwiches. Off the make everyone rest. Well, I managed to drug a bunch of them up, so it's not too much of a waste. But the rest, the rest of them can rest. Bars. Let me just. I have an idea. Let me look ahead. Where's the cheat sheet here? Um, let me write down... I'm going to notepad this. There's the list of characters that have issues. Uh, you can sometimes only get 0 0.5 on them. So they're a little bit harder. 
let's also look up what the final Monokuma is. Yeah, as long as you get the final Monokuma done, you you'll you'll actually beat the the mode. All the ones leading up to it are just giving you day trip tickets. So it's worth looking up the recipes for the final one, the Warlock Kuma, Warlock Kuma, ahead of time, and start building up to it now, just to make sure I don't lose the mode, because then I don't get the endings for the hard things that I'm building up now if I if I fail. I'm going to also put this in the notepad. Microchip. And yeah. There we go. So that's it. The Wallakuma. 10 Greek statues, 20 microchips. 30 secret book of poems, 50 paint, 30 sci-fi novels. How much have I got left? 12 days? I'm going to start doing this now. Also save the game. Can I get a second? Okay, let's have a look. Greek statue. I got five already. I need ten. One, two, three, okay, two more. Microchip, uh, 20. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Secret book of poems. One, two, three, four, five, six. Paint. Two, three, four, five. Sci-fi novel. Wait, I think sci-fi novel is just like... A random thing you can find. Yeah, that's not a craftable. I have to find 30 of them. I have to make 50 paints. Fuck, alright. I'm going to look for watercolors, music score, um, microchip, lots of screws. That's a lot of paint. They're making a giant monokuma. It's called a warlock kuma, so it, I'm guessing that means warlock monokuma, which is pretty badass. Okay, watercolor paints, art room. He's pretty fired up. I need to send him to a three HP level uh, area. Music score. I need it for the secret book of poems. Yeah, alright. Anyone who's read, come with me to the music room. We're going for music scores. Sleep. 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 You. Watercolor paints. Sleep, sleep. Music score room. Music score room. You're fired up, music score room. Uh, 
um, watercolor paints for you. No. Fucking clean. I don't have enough cleaners. Wait. You can clean as well. What are you doing? Music room. Okay, cool. Let's see watercolor paints. Music scores. Oh my god, music scores hit 17. Watercolor paints only three. But, you know, I'll live. Okay. Last day with Celeste. There's no point in saving because I'm only 0 0.5 off her end. Oh, that's a full one. So the 0 0.5 yesterday was a complete waste. Amazing. Okay, she's ready for the ending. Um, this... That cleaning bar's getting low. Isn't that Sandwich! Wonderful. Times two, thank See? you. You're so kind. Secret book of poems? One, two, three, three, three. We're up to 13 of 30. It's, 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 get, it's getting somewhere. Microchip, no. Secret book of poems, paint. Yikes. Bag of screws. Okie dokie. Who's sleeping today? You are. And you are. Oh, that's not much. That's good. I like this system for now. Anyone that's red goes to music room. Anyone that's anything less than that goes to art room. I think that's going to work out well. You need to go cleaning with the rest of them. Music room. Art room. Music room. Music room. Nailed it. Six music scores, ten watercolor paints, six chisels. Good find. I did need those. Do a save here before I forget. Dave? I'm gonna cut a new day 25. It's now what, 30 something? Hey, she's done. Yeah. Alright. Report cards. He's actually pretty close to finished, I think. Let me just check. Yeah, he's up to four already. Let's get him done. Let's 
spend some time. It's not even talking to me. Okay, hang on. Where's my cheat sheet for this? Uh, Boyaku gone? There he is. There he is. What would you like to give him? Oh, he's got actually quite a lot of stuff you can give him. Civet coffee, scarab brooch. Scarab brooch. I see. A bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. What? It's a proverb. It means you can only obtain something inferior that's still better than longing for something better. What? So in other Put words... Put another way, if all you have is nearby is a loser, that's better than proper assistant far away. What? Hm. You call me a loser. Makoto, be my secretary. Hm. A useless commoner like you could never hope to earn more than, say, $100,000 a year. But as my secretary, you'd be a guaranteed an ample salary and job security for the rest of your life. Now that is why he's saying he likes me. In honor of it being my birthday today, how about I multiply your already impossible expectations by 5.5? $100,000 times 5.5. What? What? $550,000? What? As my secretary, you wouldn't be a mere servant. At some point, I would want you to become an actual assistant, taking the lead in important projects. Assuming you can produce acceptable results, you could even become a core part of the Tagami so Corporation. In other words, you have no reason to refuse. Damn. I'm gonna have to say no. I'm trying to give you a chance to enter the battlefield in life of life and claim victory. Most commoners would never be able to get that chance. This is literally the once in a lifetime opportunity. Do you understand? This is your chance. Your one and only chance to rise above the 99%. So that's it. I like being condescended to. I want to earn it. I don't want it handed to me. I want to find something you're willing to fight and die for. And then you meant what you said earlier. That you can, if you can live a life that you're satisfied with, that's all that matters. I see. I'm glad to see you pass my test. That wasn't a test. I'm pretending it was now to save face. Naturally. The mere thought of someone like you as my secretary makes me physically ill. What? Salary offer still stands. It's yours if you want it. I don't need you spreading rumors that Byakuya Togami doesn't honor its word. Was this the final? I just don't understand you. You don't want to fight, but you don't flee from the battle either. Man, I'm just trying to live my life, bro. <laughs> Interesting. Enforce your will to the very end. If you can do that, if you can make it to the end, I'm afraid I'll be forced to acknowledge you. <laughs> you know what? I think we're done. We're done? Skill points? Nope. There's more. I gotta go back to him at least one more time. Well, that was just silly. I probably should have taken that offer. $550,000 a year to be an assistant secretary, whatever. It's not bad. Secret book of poems is coming along nicely. Greek statue, Greek statue. That's 10, we're done there. Paint, 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 paint. How much of this science fiction book do I have? Sci-fi novel, 30. What do I need there? Sci-fi novel. Th oh, okay. Yeah. I need 30 sci-fi novels. I just so happen to have 29. So that works out. Fucking and rolling. Uh, go to bed. And go to bed. 
everybody else, what are we doing? Uh, I think the usual. Go for those music scores. Well, everyone else goes for watercolored paints. It's a good system. Oh, my best cleaning girl has to go to bed. That's lame. Actually, a lot of the girls have to go to bed. Whoops. What's the deal, ladies? Music score. What are called paints? What are paints? Alright. Oh my god! <laughs> I just noticed this. <laughs> look at um, I don't know if you could how well you could see that on your screen, but look at um, Hina when she's sleeping. Unlike most of the other characters, her titties protrude through the blanket. There's two big, there's two big balls under her um, under her blanket. That's actually hilarious. <laughs> Her blanket has cleavage. <laughs> you can kind of see like a boob indentation on Sakura as well. But for some reason, Hina's is bigger in these little tiny 8-bit drawings. Hell yeah, giggity. I mean, technically speaking, Sakura's got the... Sakura's got the biggest tits. I mean, we've seen them from the side at least. But, as far as this drawing's concerned... Hin is the winner there. It's so funny, I can't believe I never noticed that before. Also, um... Um... Mukbang... Posing as Junko... Is showing completely flat blanket. Hina is proportionally bigger than her rip cage. Yeah, I guess... The entirety of Sakura is pretty large, like her entire chest shoulder width thing is probably taking away from some of the curvage. You know, the curved silhouette. Whereas Hina is kind of a waif, so her tits kind of show out more. What am I... Oh, we gotta finish him. Spend time. What? What? We grew a little closer today. Give him a present? Yes. He's got plenty of options. Uh, golden gun, old timey radio, crystal skull. I don't think I've got the golden gun yet. I don't think I've ever seen it. I have a feeling it would be right here, next to the other weapons. So, old timey radio, there's one. Crystal skull, there's one. Take the old tiny radio. There we go. I see. How do you still not understand? Hmm. I've been sacrificing all this valuable time for your sake, but it's all amounted to nothing. We have nothing to talk about. Not possible. We could talk forever and a day, and I would gain nothing from it. Aren't we friends? You're my friend, right, Bakuga? You and I will never understand each other. We live in different worlds. Our ways of life, our ways of thinking are totally incompatible. You're a loser, so go ahead and live your loser life. Make a bunch of loser friends. <laughs> Why are you doing this to me? You're so mean. Together you can lick each other's loser wounds. <laughs> Gross. You don't have to keep saying That's loser. Enough. Whether your self-indulgence is a lie or not, it doesn't matter. Whatever happens, I'm going to keep on fighting and I'm going to keep on winning. That's right. That's one thing that will never change. <laughs> That's harsh. Such is the fate of the Chosen. You keep talking about the Chosen. What does that mean? I don't think that word means what you think it means. That's fine. If I'm going to waste my time with you anyway, I might as well explain this one last thing. I'll tell you how I became known as the ultimate affluent prodigy. Progeny. I know, you came out of a rich vagina. It's not really that much more complicated. 
So in other words, it has to do with the secret to the Togami family's prosperity. Our success comes from our family's rather peculiar inheritance system. Hmm. Our family head never takes a wife. Rather, he couples with an exceptional women in the world over in order to bear as many children as possible. Huh? Hmm. Then they make the children compete, and only one can come out on top. Whoever it is earns the right to become the next head of the family. That's rough. That's a bit like... That's like the rich people version of um, the Spartans. That's right. There were 15 of us in total. When all was said and done, only one was standing. The youngest brother, me. <laughs> in the entire history of the Togama family, the youngest male has never won. He's very proud of himself. What? I won my title in open combat. That is how I became the ultimate. Okay, stop calling it combat. You didn't actually, like, fight in a in an octagon cage with barbed wire on the top. Stupid rich people shit. I was not born into greatness. I had to earn Another it. Word. I put my life on the line and earned the right to be called the Chosen. What about your siblings? Dead. Actually dead? Stop talking. I don't mean literally. They became dead to the family, unfit for the name of Togami. Well, see, nothing in your family is literal. It's all stupid rich people <laughs> shit. For them, it really is like death. They're forced to become one of the 99%, one of you. Yeah, here he comes back with the... The Condon... Ah, oh, my eye. With the condescension... Hmm. You can't even imagine, which is why the survivor is recognized as the Chosen. When you take over as the head of the family, all the weight of that family becomes to rest on your shoulders. So, in other words... That is how dedicated I am. Jesus. Hmm. This is kind of bleak. This is kind of tragic. <laughs> All I say at this point is that I'm going to win this game too. It's been a long time since I've had so much fun. I need to get as much enjoyment out of it as possible. Don't make me In the end, myself. I will stand victorious. I won't lose to the Mastermind or you or anyone else. I will live and I will In win. In the name of my family. Okay, dude. I mean, you do. We all... Uh, six of us win. It's not just you. But at least you do survive, so you kind of s stepped up to um, somewhat some part of your claims. That's fair. Goodbye. Alright, we're friends. Great. Let me be crystal clear. We will no longer have anything to talk about. Do not come to me like this ever again. Goodbye, loser. I'm going to actually show up and talk to him just to piss him off. And tell me what to do. Yay, he's done. Achieve. Whoa, that cleaning bar went down really low. Jesus Christ. That's scary. Oh, the heavy arms, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> Gas burner and the welder. Ah, it's not happening. Just thought I'd check. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. You'd better start taking this seriously. I know you can do better. Anyone could. He doesn't have much to say when you fail. There's the... The Warlock Kuma is finally here. I've already got a good head start. Eight days. <laughs> It's eight days till day 50, isn't it? So this is the final stretch. Groovy. I'm so ready for it. That needs a bit of a pick-me-up. Rig statues are ready. Microchips are not. We need bags of screws. I can't believe I need 50 paint. This is scary. Paint. 
watercolor tree. See, watercolor and tree branches are both like scarily rare. Bibbidi bobbidi boo, I'm coming after you. I don't know, eight days is starting to seem a little concerning here. someone back to life. Let's, let's get everyone into this. Good stuff. Um. Maybe these would be good. Maybe I should make some of these. No? Use a brick statues to make this though. It's not worth it. Science materials collected. Science materials. Science materials. Integrated circuits? No. Fuck, not worth it at all. Okay, man. I'm a little scared. Bag of screws and sack of marbles. Let's send uh, the yellows after that. Tree branch. Okay, girls. Go get that tree branch. Boys, keep going for the music score. Okay. Oh my lord. Music score, we got eight. Free branch, 11. Those are pretty good. Bag of screws, two. Not great. Sack of marbles, one. Not great. Since we've done him, let's do his little BDSM sex freak friend. Oh wait, have I ever hung out with her before? Let me just double check. Pretty sure I have. Yep, I've got up to three. It's been time. Cheat sheet is somewhere. Toko, got it. Whoa, Toko goes up to eight. Holy shit, she's got a lot. What we're giving her. Uh, everlasting bracelet, glasses.
Glasses. Glasses. Okay, there we go. Hey, I want to talk to you. Are you listening? Yes, I wanted to make clear something up. I have to. I don't want you to get the wrong idea about not having any love in real life. I don't want you thinking I don't have experience. It's something like me has gone on a date. It's true, I'm not lying. I'll tell you about it if you really want to hear. I was in junior high. Out of nowhere, this guy from another class asked me out. He asked me to make plans for the date. I stayed up all night for three days planning it. Oh, this is going to be sad. This is like the carry situation. Whoa. Calm down. When you're talking traditional date stuff, what do you think it was? Going to a movie. It was a movie. It's pretty cool, right? You go watch it and afterwards talk about it passionately. The ideal first date. I had to decide what to go see. We were in junior high and we couldn't go see some kids movie. I wanted something really action packed. Guy would like that kind of thing. Get you both pumped up. Decided to check out a Seijun Suzuki triple feature. Tokyo Drifter fighting LG branded to kill. Okay. This sounds like uh, film buff shit. World famous for his one-of-a-kind aesthetic, his unique blending of color. The killer is the main character and he gets riled up by the smell of cooked rice. A murder masterpiece. This sounds like hipster film buff stuff. That maybe her date might have might not have understood. I learned that the hard way. He must have hated it because it disappeared right in the middle of the first movie. He left? Wait. I found out it was just a dare anyway. He lost a bet with his friends. Oh, this is harsh. Okay, this is not my fault that I dredged up terrible memories. You wanted to tell me this. Do you like humiliating me this much? That's how you get your kicks? I've finally seen the real you. I can't be around you in your perverted fetish anymore. I'm leaving. I thought you liked being around perverted fetishes. Isn't that your perverted fetish? I mean, that's still progress, I guess. God damn, she has a lot of... Eight? Nobody else I've seen in here has eight. Eight required dates to complete the report card. Um, this is Probably because they start to become uh, genocide jack dates. So maybe there's four each. Yes, indeed. Oh, I don't. I don't want to take a week off at all. Good lord, this would be much better spent actually doing some work. We need a lot of items still. Hi. What's your problem? More pity. No, not more pity. We're hanging out. At least she's got a lot of possible maiden's handbag novelist pen. Novelist's pen. Maiden's handbag? You can have that. I can feel her silent pressure on me stronger than ever. Take responsibility. I've been trapped in here for too long. There's nothing to do. The boredom's killing me. I thought I could write my next novel, The Pinnacle of Romance, but I can't do it. I've got writer's block. My powers of delusion are a complete slump. You did it. You did it when you opened up these old wounds. Actually, wouldn't that make it easier to write? Like, draw from your own life, your own experiences. She's retiring. Oh my god. Anyway. I'm done. I was never all that good in the first place. You're actually published, though. Do not believe. Okay. 
Look at why you started writing. Reflect on that. It'll give you at least a little motivation. I started with a single love letter. When I was in elementary, I fell in love for the first time. He was a friend. There weren't any feelings at first. He was the only boy I could talk to without getting hung up. Hung up. But then he told me his family was moving to Shikoku? I could feel my chest tighten. I didn't understand what I was feeling. It was a total mystery. I was too embarrassed to tell him how I felt. I wrote him a love letter and then... The next day he left, I saw he'd hung the letter up on the school bulletin board. What? He hated the fact that I talked to him so much. All the other kids used to make fun of him for it. Wow, she has a... She has a really tragic childhood. Good lord. <sighs> One of the teachers read the letter, said I had a talent for writing. That's what sparked my interest. Yeah, but that other part was harsh. Why is it that... It okay, that's why she has this weird fetish. Every dude in her entire life, from childhood, has been an absolute trash bag to her. Write something other than romance. Interesting concept. Like what? I don't think she could write good sci-fi. It's not a bad idea. I'm gonna do it. From the heart. I'm gonna do it. Okay, cool. That's more progress than the last time I talked to her. Pity. Yep, that's it. I'm gonna run out of gifts to give her, actually, if this keeps up. She's got too many dates. Antique doll and the, and the pen. What is that antique doll? Makoto, could you come to my room? Wait, this is too early for this. What's your problem? I want to show you something. Okay. That does seem very forward for her. And her introversion. Whoa, dude! <laughs> Are these all stuff you've written? <laughs> That's a lot. I didn't ask you here for anything like that. You lay a hand on me, I'll bite my own tongue off and choke on the blood till I'm dead. That's not the reaction you're supposed to have. How about bite the other person's tongue off so they choke to death and die? Jesus Christ. Why kill yourself? I was hoping you would read this. Oh, she wrote the thing already. She handed me a massive stack of thick paper. She wrote an entire novel already? your problem I took your advice and started writing I wanted you to be the first to read okay am I gonna read the whole thing right in front of her the entire book I don't know if I've ever read anything that's good <laughs> it sounds a bit thick the way you said it it's really dark super dark reading it kind of makes me want to die <laughs> is that is that a good thing You know what they call the type of writing where the author has directly experienced the subject matter? It's kind of a naturalistic style, popular in Japan. Kaita Tayama's Futon started it all. Uh... I might... I, I don't know. Bill Dung's Ramen? Well. Totally wrong. Bildang's Roman places the emphasis on the protagonist's process of self-formation and discovery. Okay, well, I fucked that up.
I novel? Correct, okay. Yeah, I don't know was obviously a joke answer. I'm telling you. It's going to become a shocking masterpiece. It'll change the face of I novel forever. It's some dark, heavy stuff, but it's the kind of thing you just can't put down. Nice. <laughs> I want to read it. She's the Brett Easton Ellis of female anime characters. I'm so embarrassed. Is the I short for introspective? Or maybe. I'm sure if you um, googled it, because it sounds like it's a real thing. Oh, introspective. Yeah, introspective novel. That probably makes the most sense. I can't think of any other I word that would fit. Unless it just literally means I, as in myself. A novel from the myself perspective. <sighs> On a locked and rusted door, I duck my nails in and drag them down. Warm blood mixed with old rust flowing down my wrist, coils like a snake embracing my body. You watch me, you s a smile in your eyes, you watch. Time runs away, and with you it. You leave me drowning in the Red Sea. <laughs> Did she just write me a love letter, but like in... Like goth style? Okay, cool. <laughs> You've helped me find my motivation. Now I have to do my best to bring the story to an end. What's this your problem? Seems like the end of her arc. <laughs> oh, cool. True friends. This is the end of her arc. But there's meant to be up to eight with her. Unless she turns into Genocide Jill from now on, and that makes like a whole new arc. Just how I, we say I to refer to ourselves. Oh, okay. I think it would have been cooler if it was short for introspective. I like that idea better. So there is still Jill stuff. Okay, that makes sense why the guide is showing eight stories. Because that ended way too early. Day 43. I'm a little worried. I might not I might not actually make it. Secret book of poems is meant to be 30. That's at 22. Microchip is at 9 of 20. That's not going great. Paint needs to be at 50, which is obscene, and it's stuck at 15 right now. Paint is the one that's really concerning me. We need to hit those watercolors, like, hard, somehow. Mom's warm milk. Yeah. Tools. Art. It's the paint one that's really fucking me up here. I'm gonna lose all that progress with, um, the day trip relationship building where I got the 10 hearts for Sakura and with um, Celeste if I don't make this which is rough that's really upsetting um, I can make a Mona Lisa tool which will double the number of art materials collected in a day But I have to spend two Greek statues. Oh wait, okay. I'm gonna make two extra Greek statues. So there's 12. And build a Mona Lisa. How do I use it? Personal effects? Tools. Wait, is it just having one that... Oh, maybe just having it in your inventory has the effect. So now maybe I've just 
permanently doubling the amount of arc materials. Ooh, interesting. Maybe that was worth spending what I did to make it. Because art materials is the main thing that I need to get the paint made. But even with that, it's still kind of dubious that I could even make it. But we'll see. Six days. Nobody's sleeping today as well, which is great. So... If I send everybody... Except for the ones doing the cleaning. I'll leave three of you on cleaning. Everybody else, we're going art room. Go nuts, people. I want to see some hustle. Let me just double check this. Um, I want to make sure that that is actually passive. Is level 6 the max level? Uh, no, level 9 is the max level. You can uh, craft materials to increase those, but they also increase just from doing the job. Most of those levels that I've got at 5 in 5s there are just from them actually scavenging. Um... Tools. Items that can be made to help you only get one use. Let's go bigger, happy, havoc. Uh, Mona Lisa. What? Was it called Mona Lisa? Um, let's just go tools. Work on the material doubling tools. Make the mop glasses and at least three tools before the first deadline. Do items listed, uh, wait, items listed under the tools tab permanently affect everyone. No items made or gathered carry over. So you'll have to remake them as soon as you start a new run. Spam gathering materials for the cheat sheet. Uh, you should be making this item every chance you get. You can have one level 9 cleaner handle the cleaning job solo. This frees up someone else for gathering as well. So if you get one person to level 9 with the cleaning, you can literally just use them, just the one person, to clean every day. Um, not counting when they need to rest. So maybe if you had two and you alternated them, Okay. Everyone's good to go. We're going nuts today. Yep. Holy shit! 42 watercolor paints. <laughs> damn! Damn, damn. <laughs> 42. 
That's nuts. Okay, I wish I didn't have to... They make you go do this. Is that what you needed? Um, I need more. Uh, it's not the only thing I need. It's watercolor paints and one other thing, but the watercolor paints is the harder of the two to get. Um, yeah, it's annoying that I can't go straight back to that construction screen. I have to do this first, and then I get to go back. You gotta do it in the order that the game makes you do it. There's Genocide Jill. You want me to kill you or something? Yes. Mm, totally kill me. Not adorable. I'm into it. Wait, does Genocide Jack have the same gifts as um, Toko? I'm not seeing a separate entry for. I'm guessing it's just the same as Toko. Man, girl, you are gonna waste all my good shit. What? Uh, but did you need the moment? Yeah, yeah. The um, the watercolor paints was the one I was really worried about because getting them is what was holding me back quite a bit from making the um, making the paint. It's funny how you need watercolored paints as a material to just make paint. I need a more complicated paint to just make regular paint. <sighs> Let's give her the pen. Where the pen at? There it is. Oh no! What? Um, this is a school announcement. Did, did she just waste my pen? And okay, I got nothing then. out of it? Sweet dreams. What the fuck was that? <laughs> oh, okay, Hina, great. I need to... Why did that... Geno... No? Jill? No. Jack? No. I don't get it. Genocide Jill Gifts. Uh, Toka's free time events must be completed before Jack's can be accessed. Jack's route must be completed in order to receive the last three pages for the report card. Oh, you motherfucker. He has separate shit to um, Toko, but it's not in the guide I was looking at. So I threw away that pen by accident. That's a shame. I don't have a save to fix that either. Boo. I could have given that pen to the fatty. That would have been a good gift for him, I think. Well, I'm going to just save this to my notepad. Loves, likes. I do have a ton of money. <laughs> Pretty good. Let's uh, lay this out better so I can actually read it well. Better? Alright.
How did that do for us? Paint. Twenty-one, three, two, three, four, five, six. All right, we're up to twenty-six. That's halfway. Um, we'll need a little bit more watercolored paint, but we need tree branches. Microchips. Poems. A tree branch. Musical score. Bag of screws. Wait. Humanities materials con uh, collected. Science materials. Art. Physical education. General. Is, do you think general is... Reduces the amount of HP lost when collecting materials? That's a good one. Holy shit. Coke bottle glasses. Hell yeah. Raises cleaning efficiency. Okay, wait. Making that. Greatly raises cleaning efficiency. So it's worth having at least one of each of these. For damn sure. I think what I need is this. Steering wheels. Oh yeah, one, two, three, four, five. Boom. I hope general materials is the type of materials that have the little screw picture. Because this physical education I think is the soccer ball. We know what art is. Science is the little beaker with the purple juice. Humanities, I'm guessing, is the book picture. So general must be the... So that might help me. The music score. Bag of screws. Tree branch. Oh my god. You're yellow, you can't go up here. Bag of screws, okay. Sleep. 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 Do a big bag of screws run. He's huge. Where are you going, bo big boy? Tree branches. Okay, all reds are going tree branches. All yellows are going for bags of screws. Um, tree branch. Bed. Tree branch. Screws, make screws, back of screws. Can I get away with just two cleaners? I'm gonna go for it. Fourteen bags of screws, eight sacks of marbles, eighteen tree branches. That that is that's a good hole. Tree branches can sometimes be a little bit rare. 
I've had runs where I've had a bunch of people on that um, in that room and nobody found any tree branches. All right, let's try this again, Jack. Everlasting bracelet, maiden's handbag, Kokeshi Dynamo. I love that line. Does Jack count as like a new person? Do I have to give her a gift? Oh, that did nothing. Oh my god. Okay, so I didn't give her a present and nothing happened. <laughs> I think I do have to... This is... I've just wasted two days on Genocide Jack. Cool. Coke bottle glasses. Reduces the amount of HP lost when collecting materials. That's really good. Paint. I'm at 36 of 50. Sixteen of twenty. Twenty-two of thirty. Man. Do you want to make it any tighter than this? Good lord. I really should make those Coke bottle glasses though. Maybe I should have done that first. To give gift. Damn it. Discovered that the hard way. Bag of screws, sack of marbles. Someone needs to go get a sci fi novel. I'll let you do it. You. Musical score. Someone's fired up. Nice. Lots of cleaning. Sleep. 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 Uh, you... Six musical scores. That could have been better. I'm not leveling up as fast anymore. Alright, third time. Genocide check. Probably save. Yes. Now, Kokeshi Dynamo. Let's see if I've got that.
Yes, I do. It's so wonderful. Can I lick it? <laughs> when you get something this nice, don't you just love to lick it? Or is that just me? I think it's because your tongue has like, got a mind of its own. So lick away. Huh? Hey, Makiuti. Listen up. Makiuti? That's a bit of a fail of a pet name. Hi. Something's building up, you know. Stress, mainly. It's because I haven't gotten to kill anyone lately, so it's building up. It's packed in there tight. Are going to kill me? Why do you kill people? You should stop. Are you telling that to a psycho? I know that's stupid. Don't kill because it has meaning. Let me ask you something, Mr. Smarty Pants. Why does a soccer player kick stuff? Why does a bookstore manager sell books? You never asked them that, right? It's a good thing with me. Oh, the balls trying to lecture the Mighty Morphin Murderous Fiend. Mighty Morphin Murderous Fiend. That That's a good name. It's easier to kill than to try not to. <laughs> that was a hell of a date. You unlock the skill trigger happy. Wow. That was great. How did she not chomp down on it? Yeah, because she's got shark teeth as well. I really hope it doesn't hit Sunday. I don't need a Sunday right now. <laughs> Five off the secret book poems. Oh, one off microchip. Oh my god. Microchip and Secret Book are so close. Unbelievably. Bunch of more musical scores. Just two more bags of screws. Watercolored paints. And tree branches. Okay. A bit. Uh. Okay, the cleaners are. Oh, whoa! My cleaning meter is huge. Interesting. You can actually do something else today. You go for a bag of screw. No. And just split people between tree branches and musical scores. Let's go musical scores with the boys. What was musical scores for again? Secret Book of Poems. Okay, no, more, 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 most people need to go on watercolor paints. Uh, and then... Oh, fuck. Watercolor paint and tree branch is the most important. Branches. And tree branches.
Oh, someone does need to go for a bag of screws. Whoops. Let's... You go for it. Okay. Oh my god, I'm stressed. It's gonna be so close. That's a lot of good stuff. But I gotta wait till after the date to find out how close I am. Maiden's handbag, everlasting bracelet. Everlasting bracelet. Go. <laughs> That's never ever gonna get old. Hey, Maki Chan, would you like to talk about today? A Mac uh, my pet name changes every single day I talk to her. Maki Chan's a good one. I dig it. What's wrong? You don't want to talk to me. When did you appear? When were you born? What, 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 what? what the hell are you trying to say? Mm, Who yes, knows? I don't remember yes. the how or the why. Not everything's got a big dramatic backstory. Maybe it was just a coincidence or bad timing or some other nonsense. Maybe living in a repressed modern society caused by unexpected reactions to bubble up. That's a lot very wordy for genocide, Jill. The other bee is a total downer, so what would make me... What do you think, quiz time? Hope you've been brushing on your Japanese. Oh, Did the boot fire. heel of passion just kicked out the back door of your brain? Oh my god. Okay, it's not karaoke. It's Genki or Sun Sunder? Thick Big Mac was her best one. Yeah, <laughs> for sure. I'm gonna go with Sunder. I see. Oh, okay, it was Genki. As a response to that emotional black hole, an energetic supernova was born. She wants to read her stuffy classics, but give me a good erotic thriller and I'm set. Yes, yes. Anyway, we're not all that special. Can anyone have that kind of weird reaction? You know, I mean, hell, the human mind itself is basically our own split personality. Uh, it's true, what else could be headlines filled with stories of murder, theft, fraud, and all that crap? Do you think she sometimes accidentally licks her hair and then gets hair all in her, all in her mouth? I think it's touching her hair right now. That tongue's getting real close. Embrace it, indulge your consciousness the way you've always wanted to. I'm not as twisted as you might think. You and me are both gazed at the same horizon, don't we? It's all my fault, but I can never understand whatever it is. You seem to be totally lacking, Genki, so let me give you some words of wisdom to lift your spirits. Even a monkey can fall out of a tree, hit its head and slip into a coma and die. And she's gone. That was great. I think there might be one more for her. So at least one or two. Forty-seven. <laughs> hey, lunch milk. Thanks, Monokuma. Oh, so close. I need one, two, three, four. Five. I need six musical scores. Microchips are done. Holy fuck, I might make it. Paint is 48 out of 50. Three more secret books of poems. Two more paints. Alright. We need to nut this out. Um... So I need six musical scores. Three watercolored paints. Two tree branches. Watercolored paint, tree branch, musical score. Musical score, paint, tree branch. Nope, we gotta get people involved here. 
A sunder is a person, someone who usually hides their feelings of bashfulness in front of a crush. Oh, so that is Toko. So Toko is a sunder, and uh, Jill is a Genki. The opposite. You want some lunch milk? Um, Jill? You? Okay, good enough. Go nuts, Jack. Tree branch. Musical score. And the watercolor paints. So. Musical score. Watercolor paints. Watercolor paints. Musical score. Tree branch. Cleaning. both clean. The boys cleaning today. Um, you are on tree branch. Watercolor paints. Tree branch. So three tree branches, three musical scores. Oh, and you. Uh... Which one did I need more of? Was it musical score? Either or. Let's just run it. Good luck, everybody. Musical score 16. Nailed it. Smashed it. Watercolors paints, 10. Smashed it. Tree branches, 20. Smashed it. We're there, boys. Oh, fuck. I think I just beat school mode with, like, two days to spare. I was so close to... You know what would have actually fucked me completely? You know what saved me? Was the discovery of the tools that double the amount of items you get out of each category. If I had not noticed that that was a thing... I think that would have fucked me up. That was a lucky find. Like, that was one of those things where it's like, here's a game mechanic that you actually really need to get through this. And if you don't notice it's there, good luck, buddy. You're gonna have a bad time. But the funny thing is, is I found it just in enough, enough time to only just make it through this. Which is, like, almost making me feel physically ill. I don't like it when things are cut that close when it comes to luck. There but for the grace of God go I. There's a multiverse where Sean didn't make it, and that Sean, um... Sold his computer and became a farmer, grew turnips, and sold them to the Ukraine as part of the war effort against Russia. In fact, that Sean's probably more productive to society, so maybe failing would have ended up on a better life track. A lot to think about there. But since that's not how my life went, I'm gonna go back to dating this psychopath. What? what, what, what? <laughs> uh, I'm gonna make that my ringtone on my phone. Every time someone calls me, I want it to go, what, 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 what? Mm, totally not adorable. Oh, I'm so adorable. You know I am. I think I've. I might have run out of presents that Jack loves. She's only got three love presents. That's not great. Let me just double check the 
Maiden's handbag. But I gave that to somebody else recently. Yeah, it's gone. Alright, I'm gonna have to go down to her likes instead of loves, and hopefully that... I don't really know what the difference is, but it's, if it results in still giving me a relationship level, it's not gonna matter either way. Royal curry. She likes that. That's a good noise. You called for me and so I appear. Genocide! Genocide? Makoko Chanel, this is the last time you get a chance to party with yours truly. What, did she just change my nickname to Makoko Chanel? <laughs> uh, um, I'm never calling him by his, his normal name again. From now on, he's Makoko Chanel. Wait, what was the other one that was good? Uh, that you liked? Charquil? Big Mac? I don't know, man. Big Mac was nice and simple. But Makoko Chanel, I think, is funnier. <laughs> if there's anything you've been waiting to blow me away with, you better pull the trigger right now. Oh, Christ. Nothing at all. Just sit back and enjoy. I'm gonna confess my feelings to you, my feelings master. To be honest, this is the first time I've ever had feelings for someone, but not wanting to kill them. My beautiful scissors! I, I don't want to see your scissors. Whenever I fell for a boy, that boy fell for my scissors. The first love chased him all the way to Shinkoku to kill him. Master's something special. It's not about killing or not killing. It's not that physical connection. My feelings are totally pure this time. It's pure love. Have I actually finally got a girl to fall in love with me in this game? And unfortunately, it's fucking Genocide Jill. Yep, her chest is tight and tingly. Um, okay. Oh, hi, um, legendary anime Japan fan. God of all visual novel gamers, Genocide Jill, such a twisted girl. So twisted. But she comes up with the best nicknames. I'm never gonna forget, um, Makoko Chanel. For the, for the, as long as I live. It would be unbelievably rude to cheat on Master like that. Seriously, you're gonna become our Cupid. No, wait, no. I, I wanna Cupid me and you. I wanna see what that tongue do, come on. My little Macarena, I seriously misjudged you. You're actually a really good guy. She just changed my nickname in one conversation. I'm now Macarena. Until then, don't kill anyone. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or do kill someone. If you want to kill Hifumi or Taka, you can go right ahead. I'm cool with that. Kind of sucks for Byakuya, but I'm glad I was able to understand Genocide Jack a little better. There's no way you understand Genocide Jack. Even in the slightest. Why is he even pretending? Look, she's laughing like a maniac. I mean, she's a literal serial killer. I think if Makoko Chanel understood... Genocide Jack, even the slightest, that would be worthy of going to therapy. Try to guess how many visual novel games that I play. All of them. Twice. Each. Plus some that don't even exist. What's this now? Okay, that's just him next day. Don't be Sunday. Thank God. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Okay, he's fired up for the day. I think, I think we're done. One, two, three, nailed it. One, two, nailed it. Wallakuba. In the nick of time. Oh my god. <clears throat> you know what? Now that I think about it, it would be really difficult to play every single visual novel game that exists. Technically speaking, there's probably more visual novel games in that genre that exist than any other gaming genre. Especially if you go to, like, Japan. Like, the non-translated stuff. Visual novel games are a dime a dozen. Depending on how cheap you want to go. Like, Steam's probably got a crap ton.
So, like, I'm done. I can just, like, chill now, basically. Is there any, any point to do the tasks right now? Not really. It's over 1,006 so far? You've collected 2,000 in the last three decades? Holy shit. Is that mostly digital, like through Steam, or have you actually got, like, box copies? Like, actual physical, like, on the shelf? Like, discs and stuff. That's pretty mental. Um, I'm just gonna send them to random places. Just so they can build up their cred, you know what I'm saying? Uh... Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Uh, go to random places. Random. And... random. Zip! There we go, everyone's done. All physical copies? Nice. That means you've got a library. You got, like, a bunch of shelves, like I've got back there. Just with nothing but visual novel games on it. Alphabetized. And also in genre. You gotta have a nice, like, display. Also got some LED lights around the backs of the shelves so they glow from behind. Make the collection look really awesome. Wait, did we finish Toko? Oh, we did. Yay. Nice. So these three are all done. Uh, la la la. Report card. Mondo two. Boomy two. Uh, Stoner two. Kina three. Hero two. Okay, Hina, you win. You're the closest. <sighs> well, I have terrible shelves. Well, that's something to invest in, then. you got to make your awesome collection presentable. Get some funky shelves. On eBay, there's some good ones for, like, a hundred... Like, 120 bucks? That are, like, nice black shelves. Um... Like, black, dark brown shelves. Um, make a nice alphabetized collection like that. And then buy some of those LED light strips and strip them behind it. And then you can connect it to, um, Alexa or Google Home. And then you can voice control the color of the lights. I'm not talking to you, Alexa, I'm sorry. No, shut up. Sorry, my Alexa's now talking to me. Oh my god, she's so chatty. I think she's lonely. She's lonely in the living room. <laughs> Hi, Hina. Your boobs look very voluptuous today. Would you like a gift? Yes. Oh, I need a cheat sheet. Hang on. Whoops. Whoops. Uh, Hina. Hina. Here she is. She likes flotation donuts. Flotation donut. Bam. Ultra stoked. Hey, Makoto. I'm so tired. I need someone to massage my feet. 
And then my nips. Well... Please. One can only dream. I woke up earlier than normal, and so I decided to do push-ups, sit-ups, and a squat set. Oh my god, she's too active. It's so hard to date women like this, because they expect you to do all the physical stuff they do, and it's like, nah. <laughs> I'm good. Aww. I'm so tired. I want something sweet. Something salty? Maybe full of protein? I can help you. Oh yeah, she is obsessed with donuts, isn't she? Donuts. Um, Don't tell anyone, there's actually a bunch of frozen donuts in the warehouse. Okay. Throw those in the microwave for a few seconds, just imagine. I think she needs a high sugar intake because of how much energy she puts out. Then you can eat donuts with her. You know what? You know what she can eat donuts off? You know the little hole in the donut? You know where you can put that donut? You can have fun with that. Just tell her to eat it off without using her hands. It'll be really erotic. Just a second. Is there anyone who doesn't like donuts? Who in the whole universe can say they hate donuts? Um... Think about the sensation of biting into a donut. She is lucky she's not a fatty. First the sweetness floods your mouth and the soft dough cushions you. This is actually getting kind of erotic just describing the donuts. You get the hint of egg and butter. Don't talk about butter, that's what Mondo got turned into. Every time I think of butter now, I think of Mondo. You feel like you're falling into the center of the donut itself when people talk about the donut effect. That's what they're talking about. The donut effect is not real. You made that up. I'm drooling like Niagara Falls. Just a second. Out of my way. Or I got an uppercut with your name on it. I would not stand between her and a donut after that display. That was kind of scary. wonder how many stages she's got. Um, six. She's got six stages. Day 49. Oh god, day 49 is a double free day. I guess we're hanging out with Hina more. Oh, we gotta make the Wakaluma. Wakaluma. Hmm? What the? Oh, it's nice looking. It's a Sailor Moon! <laughs> we made a Sailor Moon Monokuma. What the? Hmm. It's not even a Monokuma anymore. Fine, whatever. What you you finished do? it, so I guess I'll give you a reward. Hey, whatever. It's um, already been 50 days. This whole thing seems totally pointless. Maybe I should figure out another approach. Yes, indeed! Go ahead and waste your time however you want till we're all done. You receive four trip uh -huh. tickets. Seems like you've been working really hard to reward you for all the effort. Let me give you this. Oh, that was a lot. That was hey, like hey. 200 ish. Of course. You don't need me to tell you, do you? Yes, indeed. Today's your weekly day off. Yep, okay. So two days, two dates with Hina. And we've successfully finished the mode. I better save it here just in case. Nope, that's not but. Sister? Sif? Lord? Okay. Hina! Let's roll. <laughs> Sometimes the way she giggles is weird. Kind of creepy, even. Prezies. Okay, kitten hair clip, G sick. Kitten hair clip. I'm so hungry. Please! Makoto, I'm so hungry. Is every single one of her character arc dates going to be about her eating habits. Oh. I need food. Anything. I don't care if it's a stack of paper. I need food. Why don't you eat more donuts? Just a second! I can't. That's my secret weapon for emergencies only. I keep gorging on something with that many calories. I'll get fat in no time. I think all this food you eat goes to your breasts. Primarily. But... 
I don't want anything sugary right now. I want a salty snack. Oh, we're back to salt. <laughs> ramen? Is ramen salty? You got it all wrong. I didn't know ramen was salty. My favorite is shoyu. You got it. Good choice. Definitely the most refreshing option. Okay. I'm a porktastic tonkutsu girl all the way through and through. <laughs> the key element of any tonkutsu ramen is the butter and the extra fat. Oh, we're back to the mondo butter. I want to make her some ramen with mondo butter and see if she notices. This tastes oh. greasy. Like greaser greasy. She gets hungry to the point where she almost passes out. You're pathetic, Makoto. I'm ashamed to know you. Just a second. Get out of my way. I'm going to show you what a real man looks like. I think she gets hangry. I think that's one of her personality traits. When she gets hungry, she turns into kind of an asshole. She's a hangry girl. Okay. Off she goes. So I'm guessing every time we go on a date, it's going to be talking about food until we become best friends. Extraordinary focus. Good unlock. It's not over yet. Going back to Hina. Hello. What would you like to do with Hina? Wouldn't you like to know? Let's go. Not to the pool. I don't want to do the pool. Definitely. Alright. G sick water lover. What is a water lover? Yeah, I don't have any G6. Water lover. Oh, it's the swimsuit. I've got two of them. Perfect. Ultra stoked. Sigh. This sucks. What happened to her? She seems way more depressed than usual. You know what's wrong? Um... Oh well. I want donuts again. <laughs> I want all the fucking donuts. I tried to convince myself I was imagining, but I totally wasn't. I'm sick I got of fat. This. Really? You don't look fat. Huh? Fat from every angle. I hate this. I hate it. Well, I've dealt with this in real life before. I may as well just accept it and embrace my new big fatty fat attitude. <laughs> what if I just keep getting fatter and fatter and it never stops? I just get disgustingly morbidly obese and then nobody wants to marry me. I didn't know she cared about marriage. I thought she was like a sports Olympic career girl. And then I die sad and alone. Nobody notices. I finally lose weight. My body starts to rot. <laughs> You know what's wrong? I ate a bagel. To someone who eats as the amount that she does and gets all hangry about it, I'm actually kind of shocked that she, her personality's flipped to being this concerned about being fat. This is like polar opposite heck? modes. I'm a total chub monster. I'm a perfect circle. Hey, you ain't the chub monster. I'm the chub monster. As in, this chubby is an absolute monster chub. Hey, yo! Up top, Hina. Okay, she's not going to give me a high five. She looks pissed. Hmm. I'm still hot? Well, I mean, yeah. Um. Then I might still make it out alive? I don't think being hot is what's going to get you out of here alive. <laughs> okay. Interesting. Interesting frame of thought. Oh, she's on a diet. Great. She'll be on a diet for, let me say, four or five hours. Then we'll catch her eating donuts again. You got it. I'm gonna be so thin it'll scare the crap out of you. Okay. Nah. My resolve is more rock hard. More rock hard than what? You got it. More than more than me. And she went to go eat donuts. I don't think she understands what dieting means. Um. One more date after this, I think. I think we have one more Hina left. Um, this is a... Day 50. 
Wait, did that say holiday again? The final day of your precious carefree school life is arrived. Whether that makes you want to jump for joy or weep till you die doesn't matter. This is it. For the rest of the day, do your very tippy-toppy best. Uh, well, it's another holiday day, so it's not like I can actually work. Not that I need to. We've already won. Just, we'll get the hint finished off. How about that? Okay. What do we need? Water lover or astral doll boy? Astral what? Boy doll. I do have another water lover. We'll see if this astro boy doll exists. Seeing it. Oh, there it is. It's freaky looking. And you know what? She's probably one of the few characters that will like the swimsuit as a love item. So I'll give her another one of those and keep the Astro Boy. Um, Makoto, can I talk for you for a sec? In your room? I want to ask you something. I mean, so can you come to my room when you get a chance? I like the way she worded that. Mm-hmm. Okay. I'm gonna motorboat. I'm gonna motorboat her into next week. Let's go. Makoto? Makoto, don't enter monologue right now. It's motorboat time. She loves nautical themed things as well, so she'll love a motorboat. Sorry. Sorry for making you have to come here. No, it's great, it's fine. Your bed looks really soft. We should sit. Um I wanna ask you something. Will you promise to give me a real answer? Well What do you think about me? I think um you have a great pair of personalities. Yeah. He's tucked in the monologuing in the act. Yeah, I bet it'll be really emo as well. <clears throat> Every thrust was like a thunderous thunderstorm. Did I just say thunderous thunderstorm? That's some bad alliteration. What do you think of me as a woman? Oh, this is actually kind of personal. What I'm trying to say is, do I have womanly charms? You've got two of them. What are you talking about? People have always told me I'm not ladylike. Well, plenty ladylike, I guess. I don't... You know what, for someone who's like a bit of a tomboy athlete, she's still like very feminine looking. Like, I wouldn't say she's not ladylike. I think it's because I've never been in love. I've never fallen in love. How can I say I'm a woman? Nah. I want you to be my boyfriend. Boom! I didn't think it was going to happen, but it's happened. Uh, okay. Makoto. Don't dare. Not like my real boyfriend, just a practice run. Still counts? I'm sure that still counts. What does practice run mean? I'm not a woman because I've never been in love and I can't fall in love because I'm not a woman. It's like a vicious cycle. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no! Oh fuck! Come on, man! Oh, she was spreading her cheeks for it, and then the computer betrayed me! Can I wait for the program to respond? Hina, please! Wait! I'm coming! I mean, I'm not. <laughs> I'd like to be. <laughs> oh, we're dying. Well timed, game. Well timed. You jackass. Unreal. What are the odds? This is like something that would happen in a sex comedy. It's always something like weird that happens at the last minute to stop, stop the action. 
I saved pretty recently as well, so that should be fine. I might have to redo one date, but I can hold down the speedrun button. Imagine getting cock blocked by a .exe crash. Sean's penis.exe stopped working. Thrills! <laughs> Hello. Okay. Guess we're probably one date behind from that save that I made. Um, what did I give her? Kitten hair clip, water lover. Okay, the kitten hair clip wasn't spent, which means neither of the. So the last two dates, I just had to speed through. Busting games. Well, that was easy. This one, this will go quick. It's like 20 seconds to get through a date if you hold down that button. Then I gave her one of my two swimsuits. What a lover. That's the one. She talks about donuts more. We hit day 50, turns out to also be a holiday for some reason. Bear says some bullshit. I go meet up with someone. This is the date we were up to. The girlfriend date, okay. Let's do a fresh save there. This date starting in the science lab. That's random. me to a room. Okay, there we go. Um, because, I mean, okay. Okay, here it is. I'll do a practice run to draw up my feminine side. That'll be the perfect position to fall in love. I know some perfect positions. I'm begging you to help me practice and pretend to be my boyfriend. What is this? Does she mean this in a completely non-physical way? How many other guy friends do I have? Please. I'm on my hands and knees here. Oh, phrasing! Oh, please! God! She doesn't even realize how traumatizing this is for a man. <laughs> you mean it? Alright. What am I supposed to do? Good question. Um... We can start with the old arm around the shoulders thing, arm around the neck, like when you're at the movies. <laughs> uh, a little bit of kissing. Okay. Here we go. Um... Uh, darling, you're home. Are you ready for dinner or should I get the bath? Oh, she wants to role play like husband and wife conversation. Huh? This is awkward, actually. Mm. Can't we just make out? 
You lied to me. You said you left your wife. Okay, this is getting worse. <laughs> oh no, this is getting worse. No way! Makoto, could you please, like, direct this for her? Like, fan up a little bit here? What am I supposed to do? Just become one crazy lady who gives up on love? First of all, do you really need to go through all this practice stuff? I mean... I'm not ladylike. I'd say that's part of your charm. Uh... If you push it and get nervous, that's totally not you, right? Personally, I think you're fine just the way you are. Not a bad, not a bad move, Makoto. Huh? Makoko Chanel. Falling in love is supposed to be fun, right? If you stress out about it, where's the fun in that? Not that I know anything about love either, so maybe that doesn't mean anything. Um... She's blushing. You've done it. You said some really cool shit. I shouldn't push it. I should just you be got me. It. Let's let's date for real. I have to wait till I meet the right person, like Jason Statham. I could be your Jason Statham. Makoko Chanel can shave his head. <laughs> Thanks, Makoto. You definitely helped lift that weight off my chest. <laughs> um, it's not easy to lift any kind of weight off your chest. That's that's a lot of weight. I don't think Makoto's got the muscle mass to lift that. Yeah. If it wasn't practice, <laughs> kidding, I'm just jerking you around. I am literally came all the way here to be jerked around. Can I get jerked around? Please, for helping you out. One for the road, HJ. She's gone. Oh, mm. there she is. I thought she left me alone in her own house, in her own apartment. What kind of girls are you into? Um, girls named Hina. <laughs> Don't get embarrassed. Damn it, Makoto! How did you how did you drop the ball on this? I have unlocked the skill ambidextrousness. Can I practice my newfound ambidextrousness on Hina's uh, boobage, please? Are we done? We're never gonna have to speak to Hina again, are we? Fuck me. This is worse than Junko. Well, the thing is, Junko was just mean. In the case of Hina, it was like literal blue ball situation. Like Hina, seriously, you're you're so mean for doing that to me. This is probably the last time in this run I have to I get to actually date somebody. Do you hear her? What would you like to do with your hero? Throw him into the sun. Huh? Just the two of us? Yeah. Yeah, okay. I'm a little nervous though. Just remember, Jihiro is a boy. Don't make any moves. Um Let me get the Jihiro cheat sheet. Sakura, Celeste, Chahiro. Oh, his is short. He's only got four. Dope. So I only have to do... I've already, already done one, so I've only got to do three. What would you like to give her? Oh, this is the part of the story when we still thought it was a her. Interesting. Blueberry perfume. Carillion camera. Where's the Carillion camera? I got two of them. All right, take one of those. Huh? A present? <laughs> Yay! Thank you so much. Oh. Oh, now you're sad. What's wrong? You don't like cameras? You just loved it a second ago. You know? Sorry. It's just that everyone else is working so hard to get us out of here. I'm no help at all. But, it's okay. But... You don't have to try and make me feel better. I know it's the truth. Uh, you're more useful when you die and become a laptop. 
if that makes you feel any better. If I was stronger, I'd be able to help somehow. I'm starting to get, like, victim vibes here. Let's bully him and push him into the pool. <laughs> Just for shits and giggles. Huh? My skills might come in handy. <laughs> if I get the chance, I'm going to work super hard and chip in. When it comes to computers, you can count on me. Get it? Chip in. He becomes a laptop. He becomes a computer chip. Secret pun there. Huh? How'd you get into programming? Uh, is it really that weird? I hate the fact that we don't know it's a boy yet. Because I keep saying things to put my foot in it. Like, most programmers are guys. And he starts crying. And I've got no idea why. You know? He's probably the most useful person outside of Kyoko. True. Followed by Sakura, who ends up having helped us from beyond the grave by breaking the locks on the headmaster's door. Was it the headmaster's door? I think it's what he what she did. There isn't much of a reason. I've always been kind of weak, you know. I was never able to run around with my friends. We had a computer at home, so I'd kill time poking around, and then I found I really um... liked it. Dad was a software engineer, and he had a bunch of programs that he'd built. I found one and started playing around and adding stuff. Cool. Um... I can tell most people get into stuff like that. It's database software. You know? A user could communicate with it, and would take this information, find out what they were looking for, as a way of interacting with the computer without having to physically type things. She said it could understand the user without them having to type things out. Um, voice recognition? <laughs> exactly. Good. Good pick. If you could talk to it, it would actually talk back. It was so much fun. I didn't even really sound like me. I would get totally absorbed in talking to it. Um... The key part of the program was getting it to recognize what I was saying. This probably is a good story setup if you'd done this in the main story before he died for um, setting you up for the laptop plot twist. Learning about all this. I've noticed that with at least two or three of the characters, like if you pursue these storylines before they die, it kind of hints towards certain plot twists or things about their character that come to light later. Um, I forget who the other character was that did that. Shit, I can't remember. You're right. My dad found out I missed with the software that permission. I thought I was going to get in so much trouble. <laughs> but he said how impressed he was. The software was able to take natural speech and pull out key search terms. He, his, yeah. his dad probably took um, credit for it too. I've been addicted to programming ever since. <laughs> Well, good for him. Uh. Huh? Well, we're, <laughs> we're going to learn a lot more about you very soon. Well, that was wholesome. You learned the skill algor algorithm. Skills I'll never get to use. Whoa. He said a bunch of new stuff there that I just skipped. I think he was just telling us to come to the gym for the final day. The morning of the 51st arrived. Monokuma told us to head to the gym. Good morning! Hi. Quiet down and listen. Well now. Today brings an end to the period of time. I promised to you. Sure it was a long time, huh? You all got up to this and that and this and this. <laughs> Of course, it's only because you were slacking off instead of focusing on building decent backups. I was ready to die from boredom. That's a way worse way to die than reaching out to grab a salmon and tripping over and tumbling over a waterfall. <laughs> what did you just say? Now I'm so flippin' angry right now. What? We made you backups. Hmm. You made this, you created it, you assembled it, you put more succinctly, this was you. Yes, we made you a Sailor Moon Monokuma, it was amazing. This is no Monokuma, this is a stupid pink rabbit. Are you trying to deny my entire existence? I didn't ask you to put your own spin on it. Oh. You kind of did. 
He kept on giving us like creative different versions of Monokumas. So it would seem. <laughs> it's like you handed us a sketchbook and gave us some vague specifications, and now you're all bad? Just give up. Build your own damn backups. Damn the rabbit's actually a character in a later game. Oh really? And we just built it in the side quest. Until I have a proper backup, your school life can begin. Yes, indeed. This is gonna keep going, keep going. Why do you sound so surprised? I just told you to finish the backup by the fiftieth day. I never said I would end on that day. <laughs> Get ready to greet another beautiful day. Oh, I guess that's the story reason for why you can now repeat this uh, side thing like a roguelike. We can't start our real school life until we do. What the hell are we ever going to get out of here? <laughs> Poo hoo. <laughs> what does that mean? Yes. <sighs> well, I don't know what he's mad about. I made him a lovely doll, and he was still weird about it. Got 646. Ah, let's have a look. Um a very long hint guide for this mode. Um. Make backup on Akumas. I just need to, th I need a hint as to what the fastest way to grind up the rest of this is. So it doesn't take too long. Okay. You must finish the final project in order to see the student endings. Failure to reach heart level 10 or do the final project means you have to retry. Wait, see student endings. I didn't see any student endings. Uh, curious. Wait. On the 51st day, if you didn't do the Wallakuma concept, then Monokuma says you'll be disappointed. We have to give it another go and accept we'll never leave Hope's Peak. We are kicked to the main menu and be sure to save.
Okay, there's something funny about this. I didn't get any student endings for um, Sakura and Celeste. I didn't see any endings. Get the relationship to 10 hearts. Complete the final concept to the endings. If you fail this project, you won't get the endings. I don't get it. Can you get one at a time? No. Um, this guide talks about maximizing how many times you have to play through the game. You can do it a minimum of three times, three playthroughs, if you combine um, as many of them as possible before you get to the end of the 50 days. So you, in three playthroughs, you can cram pretty much all of them in. What the fuck? I did get the 200 Bonner coins for completing the final concept. If you complete a bunch of students' relationship levels and you complete the Wall Akuma, you will get to see their endings. These endings are just dialogue chats with the students, so no cutscenes. After chatting with the students, they give you presents, which is their undergarments. What? Beg your pardon? Oh, okay, wait. You need all the report cards maxed out? I mean, that's a separate thing. They don't say anything about... They talk about those two things as separate things to complete in this. It's saying that it's just dialogue from the characters during that final sequence. Okay, wait. Let me check. So where is these undergarments supposed to be? Extra? Cool store. I don't like I don't like this. The trophy name, nine coins, nine purses, nine bears. <laughs> I love good achievement names. Let's go to achievements. I did all 14 endings and got stuck on 92%. Not building all Monokuma concepts shouldn't affect the ability to get the endings. 
All you have to do is build the final wall of Kuma, which I did. Fuck me. I went through that whole playthrough and maxed out Sakura and Celeste. And then at the end... It didn't give me their endings, and I'm pissed about it. It said all he had to do is get them to ten level 10 hearts, so they're, they're at the top of the chart, and then make sure you do the final Wallakuma concept completion, which I did. And I even got the 200 coins reward for completing the final one. And he even talked about having completed the final one in that last cutscene. So where are my endings? Wait, school mode is unlocked after completing the base game. We just have to unlock the mode. Doesn't mean we can achieve an ending yet. All report cards must be completely filled out before any ending can be reached. Oh, I think you. Is this what you were talking about, Charcoal? Fuck. Why didn't the bigger guide say that? Then I wouldn't have spent all that time with Celeste and Sakura building up those hearts. I could have used that time to um, complete more of the report cards. And it says, since we're not, we don't need to finish the first playthrough properly, because you're going to be spending all your time completing the report cards. Don't bother making any of the Monokuma builds. Use that time to make items to increase their um, cleaning and scavenging um, levels for the next playthroughs. <sighs> that is so frustrating, man. Yeah, I mean, once the re the report cards are almost completely finished, there's only a couple of people left, and once they're all done, that'll speed up the run much faster because everything else is just speed runnable because all the dialogue is just repeating stuff, so you can essentially skip everything and just get the jobs done. Because right now, the only thing that I'm lingering on a bit is watching the um. The report card relationship scenes because that's actually like story content for the characters um it's still a pain in the butt to have wasted all those um free days on celeste and sakura's things that didn't actually lead to anything um oh it's getting cold turn that off Pain in the behind. Hmm.
All right. Fine. Wait, where's my cursor? There we go. Get out of that. How do I escape? How do I get out of this? How do you exit? Why? Why the fuck am I trapped in here? Oh, please. Just kill me now. No! I didn't mean to do that! What the fuck even is that? Oh, I actually got something new. Whoops. Oh, now it lets me exit. So it made me spend money before it let me exit? Great. Well, that's good. At least I got something new before. <laughs> but that's weird how the exit button didn't work until I at least spent money at least once. That was, uh... That was dumb. Thrills, chills. <laughs> blah 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 blah. Skip the opening. Yes. Hi, Monokuma. Greek statue. I need to make this stuff early. That's one of the keys to this being easier. Oh good, they all kept their levels. Yay! Roguelikes. Everyone's feeling chuffed today. No one needs to do any cleaning. It's pretty handy that it does that. Um, aluminum can. Bag of screws. You know what? You'll go for that aluminum can. Wait. Oh, you can get it down on this one as well. What's the point of this then? Okay, everyone go to this. Wrench. 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 Girls. Can. 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 Bag of screws. Bag of screws. Bag of screws. Actually, you go bag of screws as well. And we're done. Everyone go nuts. A lot of good shit. Your hero. There you are. <laughs> it still says her. Unending dandelion? Tips and tip what? Tips and tips. Unending dandelion. Oh, I've got three. I'm gonna give you two. Yay! This one this date and the next date. <laughs> um 
If you don't hate the idea, would you like to talk some more? Sure. I'd love to learn more about you. Mm. What do you want to know? What program are you working on now? You know? It's like Solitaire, you know the card game you play by yourself, except with naked pictures on the cards. Like boobs, and peepees, and, bo and bums, and also the undersides of people's feet, because I heard some people are into that. I signed an NDA with a company to- okay. This kid's doing some real work. Uh, I'm sorry. I made a promise, you know. NDAs are no joke. Disney will have me killed. Mm. Maybe I can give you a hint. It has to do with simulating human thoughts. Oh, it's a chat... Uh, GPT thing. Artificial intelligence. I like the fact that all of Chihiro's um, dating arc relationship scenes are pretty much setting you up for the um, the laptop plot twist and the virtual reality designed in him his, his image. What should I do? Um. I could trust you. The, the world doesn't exist anymore. It's fine. You know. I'm working on artificial intelligence. The world has never seen before. It's what we call strong AI, designed to think like a human. Um. In the field of artificial intelligence, there's strong AI and weak AI. Weak AI isn't meant to match human intelligence. It's simply a type of problem-solving software. It's just executing actions programmed into it. Whenever we get him talking about his programming, it gets a little dull. Mm. And it is pretty much just like, yep, this is what happens with the laptop with Alter Ego. It would have been cool if I'd done these dates with him before he got killed. This would have, um, bits of good foreshadowing. But... Right now I'm just researching. I've made lots of progress on the programming side and the intelligence mm. development. When it comes to actual awareness, it's still a long way off. You know? I'm not sure how to put it, but no matter how well designed or complex a program is, software can simulate the workings of the human brain. I don't think it's enough. It's only simulating thought. It will always be lacking something. Yeah. A soul. Oh, he actually said a soul. Wow, what a guess. If you could somehow pour your own soul into the software, maybe then a strong AI could be created. Isn't that what he does? Mm. It's not a programming term. I'm not even sure how it would work on a technical level. You know? All I have right now is a theory. There's still lots of research left to do. Um. Huh? Okay, kid. Yay! Good job. It was kind of boring, but nice foreshadowing. We only have one more date left. I wonder how many dates into this playthrough it'll take to get the report cards all done. Because it'll definitely be during this run. There's not that many left. And the longest one is Ko um, Toko. And that's done. Hello, Giggles. Check if the hearts reset. Oh, it definitely... It definitely reset. I'll go there in a second, hang on. Greek statue. Aluminum can and chisel. Aluminum can, chisel. to make any but the last Monokuma backup. To successfully complete the mode, yes, but if you don't complete any of the other Monokumas, you don't earn the tickets to actually take them on the heart dates. Um, but I mean, you have to send them out scavenging anyway, so it's pretty much just go nuts at this point. Oh, everyone's still good? Okay, little Miss Cleaner. 
you can go cleaning by yourself. Yeah, I'm gonna make sure I got tickets, because once the report cards are done, I'm, I'm jumping straight into doing the hearts. Um... I've totally forgotten. It was chisel. Chisel, aluminum can. Yep. Okay. Where's chisel at? Ah. Art room. Alright, you all stay on the art room then. Um... You all can go here. What about these girls? And just start building stuff up. good that yeah I'm definitely gonna make the tools yeah now that they're at this high level they're already getting a lot more stuff just by themselves so once I start making the tools as soon as I can um, we're gonna be well ahead of a lot of them the construction projects anyway um, okay what let me check yeah see this Stop. Why do you have to talk so much? Look, all the way at the bottom again. You lose all the progress towards these hearts if you don't complete them before the end of a run. Well? And since the... The fact that I completed them didn't count because of the stupid report card rule, which is ridiculous. They almost have nothing to do with each other. I don't know why they're doing this to me. Last hero. <laughs> Although the the tickets don't carry over either. The only thing that carries over uh, playthroughs is the levels of your students in cleaning and scavenging. Pretty much everything else um, resets. Um, yep, more unending dandelion because I've got plenty of those. There it is. Yay! <laughs> Makoto, you remember your promise? Huh? You forgot already? Oh. I'm gonna kill myself. I'm sorry. Oh, he's gone. Oh, well that was that went poorly. But he's still going It's so weird having beaten the game and knowing the secret. And having to do these scenes and um, seeing the she's and the herds still being said. I headed to Jahira's room. There's a three monitor setup. Neat. And a telescope in a room that has no skylight or windows. So there's no way to use it. Should have had this mode try and do it fastest time possible. I don't need it all. Can we talk about you today? Yay! 
Yay! <laughs> Why is Chihiro so wholesome? It's almost comical. <laughs> okay. I want to hear all about you. Uh, Makoto's not really that interesting. Although, the most interesting about me is the nickname that was given to me by um, Genocide Jill. Makoko Chanel. Um, well, that's my best story. You know? What do you like to do in your spare time? TV, video games, lay around, pretty much it. Huh? Kind of boring. Macarena. <laughs> Makoko Chanel is still my number one. still so strong. Me? Yeah, no. I'm scrawny as hell. But, but... You're on the bottom rung? Oh, you shouldn't have said that, because he's even smaller than I am. If I'm the bottom rung, I just made him feel like he was subterranean. You know? I'm looking for someone strong. What about Sakura? Mm. I mean a guy. There is someone... Okay. I'm guessing... Mondo? No, it has to be a guy. Is this still when we thought Sakura was a... A guy as well? What about Mondo? Ultimate bike gang leader? Strongest guy out I there. See. Mondo it is. Are you into tough guys or something? You know? I want to start training. I'm so weak. Um... Thought if I could talk to someone strong, it might help motivate me. Yeah, but that gets you killed. Which is super tragic. Um... Some part of you that can't stand something you absolutely hate. I guess. I'm pretty ordinary. Painfully aware of it. The rest of you have ultimate abilities. I have nothing. You know? Except for being the ultimate hope. Are we gonna? Are we gonna teach Chihiro to just accept life as it is? That's. Hmm. I see. Good idea. If I don't do something, nothing's ever gonna change. <laughs> Thanks. Your advice has helped me understand. <laughs> I'm gonna become a laptop. What an aspiration. Oh, we're best friends. Report card done. Achieve. We never thought Sakura was a guy. Only Taka made that mistake. Oh, did he? I mean, all like a lot of the other characters did. There was a bunch of them in that cut one cutscene that were like, "Oh shit, really?" But they cleared that up pretty early in the story, whereas um, the Chihiro thing was held as a, a plot cool twist. Announcement. Okay then. Sweet dreams, everyone. I think it was, um, Hero that was the one that was the last person to figure it out. He must have missed the, um, the early cutscene where everyone else did. Greek statue. There it is. Oh, I see, still need two chisels. Whoops. I need all of this. Pen light, bag of screws, tree branch. Chisel. Oh wow. Whole bunch of people just piped out. Oh, the girls are all fine. Uh, chisel. Yep, we need that. You all stay on that.
need a bunch of stuff from these. Lame. Okay, Chihiro is done. Why are you all looking at me all the time? I guess Mondo. Why not? He's closest. Get it over with. I remember his first hangout where he uh, said he was going to in introduce me to the gang. Make me one of the gang members. And uh, Makoko Chanel freaked out. Yes. Although, I need my cheat sheet. Uh... Mondo. Sonic Cup of Noodle Roller Slippers. Sonic Cup of Noodle. There you go. Yeah. Also talked about riding his hog a lot. Oh yeah, there was a lot of hog talk. That was a lot of uh, awkward phrasing. Hell yeah. Duh, shit. Damn it. Damn a bitch, son of a bitch. What? Why am I so mad? I'm mad. Can't you see why I'm mad? I need to get the hell out of here. I need to get out real wild. Dude, shit. I'm so pissed. Okay. Why? How about we have a one-on-one? -on -one? Yo. Uh, what? Bare knuckle brawl? Jesus Christ! Why me? Fight Sakura. You don't want to fight Sakura because you know you'll lose. What? A bare knuckle brawl. Bare knuckle. Let's do it. You must mean. Bare knuckle ball? No. One punch knockout. Hand to hand. Hand to hand. Huh? Hell yeah. Hand to hand knuckle knuckle. Why? That's the only way I can burn off what? all this energy. What energy? Have you been eating donuts with Hina? Huh? Yeah, spar with Sakura. Or train, whatever. Damn you! Don't be a fucking idiot. I can't hit a girl. She's a girl, right? I'd ruin my honor. My mom would kill me. Piece I don't think you'd be able to hit her. I doubt. I doubt you. I doubt you'd pull it off. Damn you! Shouting's in my blood, asshole. When I get stressed, I yell. Shit. Old Epp swearing. Don't fuck with me. It's just a nervous habit. What's the big deal? Other than the fact that it makes my hard to ask girls out. I get all nervous and start yelling. <laughs> Can you imagine this dude? Approaching a chick to ask her out and just fucking screaming at her. <laughs> That's pretty funny. I'm on a 10 game losing streak right now, it really sucks. Yeah. Oh shit, I've forgotten about that too, thanks for reminding me, jackass. How you gonna make it up to me, shitstain? Call me shitstain with that hairdo of yours. Is that it? That was our hangout? He wanted a bare knuckle fight and then got stressed and yelled at me for no reason? It was kind of cute. He'd murdered me if he heard me say that, though. Did I just call Mondo cute? Unlock the skill downshift. That was weird. Okay, finally. The cleaning's going down. See? For the freebie. The Casanova's done. How much time did I have? Two days? Cool. Now I can focus more on the tools. 
Coke bottle glasses. Penlight bag of screws tree branch. Oh Christ. Wait. Oh wow, there's an X button shortcut. Straight to sleep. That's awesome. Okay, Chihiro, you're back on cleaning duty with Sayaka. There's the pen light. Okay, you're all in the music room. Oh my god, everyone's depressed. That's crazy. Almost everyone's sleeping. branch. Yep. This is a rough day. There was nobody working. Happy? Roller slippers, fresh bindings, chinchilla cover. Roller slippers. Everyone went to rooms that decreased a lot of energy. Yeah, I was trying to get some of the big stuff down as fast as possible. Because a lot of the um, rarer items in the bigger rooms go into making the tools. Fresh bindings, that's one of them. Yeah. Yo. Makoto. Listen, there's something I gotta ask you. What? You shut up and listen, Raw. Are you a dog person or a cat person? Stop fucking I am a cat person. Oh. I'm a dog person, by the way. What are you? Come on, tell me. Cat person. A bear person? Oh, okay, if you say that, it might get pissed because he gave me a 50-50 choice. I'm gonna say dog just to please him, but I really want to say cat. What? I grew up with a dog in the house. It was a mutt. Still pretty cute. Hell yeah. Right, cats are okay, but dogs are way cuter. No, I don't agree. How old is your dog? Hey, we had him when he was a kid. He's dead now. Oh. You know how it feels, man. Oh, it's tough to lose a dog you love so much. I totally know how you feel. Yo. Chuck, a Maltese. He died when I was nine. Dog gang? Well, we're pretending to be a dog gang. But t to be honest, I'm in the cat gang. By the way. Hell yeah. He'd look up me with his eyes of his, wiggle that little butt. I love watching my dog wiggle his butt. God damn, I love my dog's butt. My dog is such a nice butt. What a doggy butt. Oh, butts. Doggy butts. Seriously sucks. Don't look at me right now. I... God damn it. I gotta go. My baby boy, Chuck. My baby boy and his little baby butt. I'm gonna dream about that doggy butt. Doggy butt gang. And he's gone. That was a short, that was a short day. Very, oh, I got upshift. I got downshift and then upshift, like two dates in a row. Interesting. Do it five. <laughs> it's 
Isn't that wonderful? Thank you for the spirit bomb. See ya. Bye. One dust cloth and I can build a long mop. Pen light, bag of screws. Oh, no one's tired? Yeah, buddy. Today's gonna be the day when we get a lot of stuff. A lot of stuff done. Also, our cleaning's going down pretty hard. I'm gonna have to put Hero on it as well. Until I get the upgrade. Damn it, my brain. The dust cloth I remember. And like bag of screws. Where is the bag of screws? Ah. Okay, you two go for the bag of screws. Y'all follow me to the music room. Cool. Uh, the rest of you. Four. I think it's the last one. With him. And then I should probably go see Fatso. Fatso might be the last one. That's true. Chinchilla cover. What is a quality chinchilla cover? See no quality chinchilla. I don't have it. Balls. He likes the Jimmy Decay t shirt. It's not a love, but it's at least a like. Yo. Oh, where are we going? What? Oh, he's taking me what? to his room. Hey. Yes! But buddies, 
He's gonna bring his gang around. We're gonna make a daisy chain. Circle Jack? How did you get that massive banner in here? He's got hair care products on his counter. <laughs> and knuckle dusters on the coffee table. Those are weapons. You shouldn't have that in here. Yo. It's kind of cheesy, but there isn't really anyone else here I can talk to about this stuff. I can't show weakness in the cl for the classmates. I've never had a friend on the same level. Do you mind? That's true. Do you like being a high schooler? Yo. I mean, I like it. I like screwing around with my friends and stuff. Whenever I go out and run wild with my crazy diamond crew, it's such a goddamn rush. It's such a shit ton of pressure to build up the gang and everything, but still, getting to hang with the fucking best, man. Yeah. Been thinking a lot lately, what's gonna happen when I'm done with high school? Nothing's gonna happen. You're gonna be dead soon. They're gonna turn you into butter. I'm not smart like the rest of you. College, not a chance, so I gotta get a job, right? I... I just... Maybe I've already done whatever I'm gonna do in life. Maybe I'm maxed out. Can't figure out how to say it. The point is, a big part of my life with the crazy diamonds. I think about not having that anymore, I get scared. As scared as I was when I lost that good doggy butt. I miss my doggy butt. My doggy butt was so... So doggy buddy. Like butter. Irony. Butter. You're gonna be butter one day, buddy. That's true. Maybe this is punishment for everything up until now. Like killing my brother. Wait, we're not supposed to know about that yet. Shit, Makoto, you want me to put on a suit or some Yo. shit? Maybe you're right. Maybe I'm having so much fun as I did means I'll be able to dedicate myself to working hard from Hell now on. Hell yeah. I don't know about that. He's gonna be homeless. His hair looks like an ear of corn from the side. That's what I said when I first started playing the game. It looks like an ear of corn that someone used as a butt plug and turned it brown. Yo. I'm gonna be a carpenter for sure. Like Jesus. Jesus had a nice butt too, just like my dog. A doggy butt, nice Jesus butt. Nice butts all around. Why? When I'm what? a carpenter, I can build a nice butt out of wood. Nice woody butt, you know, some oak. An oaky butt, if you will. Dude, Gotta shit. love butts. What was I talking about? Hey. Oh yeah, butts. Oh, he's gone. We'll become friends. Yay, achievement. So it's just the fat man. Yep, Casanova's done. Put it in. Yeah, I remember this. He hates it. As always. This mode has its very own New Game Plus cycle. Your collection and cleaning levels carry over, but you'll be able to take another shot at it. Yes, I know this now. Monokuma Entertainment Center. Got it. Hey there. Junko's feeling pumped today. <laughs> Isn't that Lunch see? milk from the bear. Long mop is ready to go. Build it. Now the cleaning will be more effective. I need a pen light. Welder. Greek statue. One, two. Oh, damn. There's a lot of tambourines. Microchip pie binary. Five microchips? 
Nice. Binary converters, pi. So these two. Small light bulb, programming textbook. Let's make more welders for the pectoral harness. How many? Five. One, two, three, four. Okay. All right, iron plate. Small light bulb, textbook. Iron plate, small light bulb, textbook. Um. Small light bulb. Iron plate. Programming textbook. Uh, guess everyone of the girls. Except you, clean. Oh yeah, small light bulb. Uh, you go get that. Just you. Nobody else is jazzed. Buddy, that's quite a few programming textbooks, nice. Okay. Everyone in this room is done. Everyone in that cargo is done. It's fat guy and stoner left. Both kind of annoying. Okay, I guess let's do him first because he's a little bit less annoying. <sighs> Spend time together. What's his name? Hero? Hero, hero. There he is. Here's his cheat sheet. Okay, got it. Well? Come on, man. Let's chill. What's he like? Crystal Skull, Golden Airplane, Shotoku Globe. Crystal Skull, which I think is like vodka. It's the Golden Gun. The hell's the crystal? There it is. Oh, Golden Airplane. I've already got two of those. Okay, have that. He loves it. He loves it. Yo. 
Hey Makoto, what's up, my brother? Bruh. Let's raise our semi siblings up right, okay? Oh, that's right. His first hangout was him telling me the clairvoyant tarot reading about us both having kids to the same woman. Which turned out to be Hina. In that bad ending cutscene. Oh, so then. He's gonna give me another reading? Hmm. I didn't know you knew about divination tools, bro. Sounds like you know your way around the spirit world. Like, oh Yo. my god. Now that I know you're an expert, I have questions. The correct answer gets you on the discount. Could it be? 22 cards known as Major Arcana and 56 cards known as the Minor Arcana. The cards from the Major Arcana are used for divination. Do you know what I'm talking about? No. I'm gonna guess Tarot. Because that's the only word I recognize. What? What? Oh, yeah, I got it right. I will now tell you fortune for a measly 600 pounds. Okay. It's something I never say. I've had enough fortune telling for one life, so. <sighs> oh, that's, I, that's me that said that. If you don't use tools, how do you do your fortune telling? Don't be me. I make it up on the spot because I'm a grifter. I mean, I have superpowers. Yeah, that's, that's the one. I employ numerology. Oh, not numerology. Yo. Lame. Numerology, numerology is gross. Hmm. Inspirational time of fortune telling. So absolute bullshit is what you're saying. How about that? Don't describe it using such cheesy words. It's not like some occult mystery. Don't compare my clairvoyance to some occult bullcrap. It is occult bullcrap. Why do you keep saying occult stuff is different from what you do? Well. Back now and I'll throw an extra bonus to your reading. I use white magic to record a CD of spirit messages. What? Cool. A, a, a CD of angel music? What the heck? The more I talk to him, the less I understand. I think he's sapping our brain cells. That ain't good. Bear. I guess it's Sunday again, which means I get to finish off this fool. Um, hmm. I guess I'll give him another crystal skull or golden airplane. This is a faster way to scroll this. Well? Hey Makoto, you feel it with Maka Kamata? Tiny little suburb in Tokyo. Uh, yeah? Hmm. Don't tell anyone I told you this, but they appear there. Uh, um... The UMAs. Unidentified... Magical assholes? Oh my god. Thurman! Spaceships? I'm right, right? Those are UFOs, you dingus. Oh, okay. Sorry. Cryptids? Unidentified mysterious animals. Oh! You know? Good job. What kind of How cryptids? Terrifying skyfish. In the West, they're usually called rods. They can fly and they have a thin body and a wide fin. They can move their fins in a wave pattern, which lets them move faster than the naked eye can see. Could it be? I think you're full of shit. Ever you heard of the Anomalocaris? Some people think that's what the skyfish evolved from. Others think they're an artificial life form. Genetically engineered super weapon. Uh... Isn't that scary as hell? 
Where do you get this uh, stuff from? Um. <sighs> this is all a waste of time. Hmm. He wants to call the airlines and warn them about the cryptids. The cryptid skyfish. As long as they can pay my fee, I can keep things safe for them. Wow, you are a grifter. What a scam. Scam the airlines out of money to protect them from skyfish cryptids? That's kind of nuts. Oh my god, I gotta go back to him again. That's like three dates with him in a row. With nothing in between. Well? I'm gonna go grab a bite to eat in the dining hall. I'll teach you where all the best power spots are. Power spots? Hero taught me about all the best power spots. Yay! Whatever that means. Meteorite Arrowhead Sacred Tree Sprig. Meteorite Arrowhead Sacred Tree Sprig? Tree sprigs. <laughs> Yo! Hey, Mikado. I'm surprised at how well you and me get along. It seems like we hang out all the time. Well, it's three days in a row because I'm trying to get you done for my achievement. Mm. Since we're such good friends, can I ask you something? <laughs> Are you going to invite me to your bedroom? Well? Have you been feeling down the dumps? No energy or spark? You know? You don't have to hide it from me. I know what it's like. I've been there. Oh shit. Interesting. But has it on silent. You know? I love that he actually has a crystal ball. Hmm. So cheesy. He shoved the crystal ball well? in my hands. Nice and cool to the touch. Feels good, doesn't it? Yeah. You can feel his power, can't you? I do feel it. How about that? It's the age of power of the time of Mother Earth. For serious. The crystal ball is quite the history. It was found in the ruins of Atlantis. Literally a priceless one of a kind artifact. It grants enormous power to whoever holds it, bringing prosperity and peace of mind. This very ball is known the touch of Napoleon, George Washington, and Genghis Khan. This sounds like a barely believable grift. I mean, you name drop cheesy names like that. Hmm. I want to give it to you as a present. Come with me to a little seminar when we get out of here. Oh, he's going to take me to a fucking Amway meeting. Uh, I'll see you about getting a discount on your entry fee. All this occult uh, clairvoyancy stuff all just leads to money. To spending money. It's such a grift. How about that? This is so silly. <laughs> Count on you, pal. And off he goes. I feel like the more I talk to him or hang out with him, the more I'm just going to end up spending money. You unlock the skill Crystal Prediction. Okay, sure. Back to regular days? Day 8, yep. Sweet. <laughs> High calculator, binary converter. Binary converter. Oh, done. Good. Two pi calculators, and it's done. Small, small light bulbs. Cool. Small light bulbs, bag of screws, pen light. 
more light bulbs, a bag of screws, and light. Bag of screws. Um, bag of screws, bag of screws. Where's pen light? Small light bulbs up here. Or Wi Fi cut off. What? Oh, your, your Wi Fi cut off? Oh, sorry. Hang on. Did your Wi-Fi cut off, Genie? So mad. Was that just like a, um... Do you have issues with your provider? I know that some people I know that are with certain providers have like regular problems like that, depending on who you're with. Where's the pen light? Oh, there it is. Shit. Cordless, or your brother-in-law was having issues and reset the modem, or any, all of the above. What do you love about Elden Ring? <clears throat> oh, I got a hot dog bun. Did I get small light bulbs? I got eight. Okay, that's more than I needed. Merchants and use the resulting mm. bell to access the inventory in one convenient location. Oh, really? Shit, that's new. I don't believe they've done that in any of their other um, Souls likes. It's not like. Usually, killing a uh, merchant in older Souls likes is always a bad thing because you just lose the shop forever. Okay. Meteorite arrowhead. That. This is getting serious, man. When are we gonna get out of here? I don't know. Who cares? Uh, um. We talk man to man. I need to get this off my chest. Hmm. There's a big reason why I'm so anxious to get out of here. I'm a stoner, you see, and I need weed to stay level. You don't say. I'm afraid someone's gonna burn most of my house to my collections. How about that? I've been surfing black markets and black channels to build a huge collection of oop arts. 
What's an oop art? Huh? I don't know about oop arts. Out of place artifacts. Oh, like UFO. Oop art. The ones in Elden Ring can actually put up a fight. Oh, so if you start a fight with a merchant, they fight back, and you actually have to win. So if they find the ruins of ancient civilizations. Well, that's good, because one of the presents I just gave you was a, um, an old arrowhead. So that was fitting. What the heck? They could be more than just artifacts, bro. I definitely classify the famous geoglyphs of South America. Oh my god. Aztec? Could it be? How about that? Oh no, I got it wrong. Samba is a type of dance. I'm gonna go with Nazca. Nice. Yo. Plenty of museums and research centers claim to have all those different oop arts. You see, well? here's the shocking truth. For all of them, the real deal is at my house. Did I shock you? The truth slammed into your soul like the asteroid that wiped out the dinosaurs? Hmm. What? More valuable to me than anything. <sighs> that stuff gets stolen while I'm gone. It'll be the most tragic tragedy. Why do you think I got held by like three or four years? <laughs> he got held back from school three or four years because he was concentrating on collecting artifacts. Pointless trinkets. God damn it. They have big HP pools and do high damage. They're, they're almost like optional bosses, in a way. What the heck? Don't be stupid, Bakoto. It's a government cover-up. I want to hide the ancient aliens and the secrets of the universe. Okay, I'm done with you. How about that? He's talking shit again. I don't need to know all this. How long is it going to take to complete this man's bullshit? And then I've got the fat guy's bullshit still. But at least then it's going to be done. Considering I spent like 10 free times on Sakura's hearts and 10 on the uh, on Celeste's. These two would have been done by now. My report cards would have been pretty done. Wonderful. See ya. Okay. Pi calculator. One, two, done. Tools. Coke bottle glasses. Reduces HP loss. That's wonderful. Hero's an absolute moron. Yeah, it's like, I almost, I'm almost intrigued when he starts talking about something, and then after, like, a few lines, I'm like, okay, this is going nowhere. <laughs> it's just stupid shit. Secret Book of Poems, five. Five? Oh, let's make the antenna system. Done. Good. Four notebooks, more light bulbs, triangular rulers, photo album, steering wheels. Oh, one, two, three, four, five. So now I need two Venus fly traps. One welder? Okay. Two Venus fly traps. Notebook photo album box cutter. That's also very silly. Oh look who's fired up. Box cutter. Venus flytrap? Yeah. Oh, a lot of people are tired today. 
Okay. Jesus. Tired. Tired. Okay, the rest of you. Need good jobs. Ah, oh, this one. Yes. Everyone go here. Okay, cool. Nine tree branches. Good lord. Okay, hopefully this is the final hero. skull for you still. Oh, where is it? There it is. <laughs> Makoto, you ready for me to tell your fortune? Hmm. Don't be like that. This one's on me. Free of charge. No money down. It really should be free, because it's stupid. Yo! Oh, and it's in his room. Yes, this is the last one. If it's in their bedroom, we're almost done. <laughs> this fucking grifter. Yo, yo, this yo. is why Hina hates him. Hmm. Before we get to the reading, I have a little favor to ask. I'm out of here. I was right to be skeptical. Good man, Makoto. No, I'm super serious. I want to talk to you about a problem I've been having. Is it debt collectors because of what you're grifting? Someone wants to take your thumbs? Actually. Actually, yes. Do I have friends? No. I have literally zero friends. <laughs> That's not surprising. You know? This is the first time I felt like there was someone I could talk to, share my problems with. Smell my finger with, even. You don't smell my finger? It smells really good. If you don't mind telling me, I don't mind listening. Mm. Thanks. You know? Remember how I told you I got held back a few times? For serious. There's a kind of serious reason for it. Is it the mm. rash? Do you have a rash? Is it contagious? Someone's after you. D don't look at me. I think he's paranoid. I bet nobody's after him. I had an appointment come in. The daughter of some rich upper management guy. I pressured her a little to put out her entire life savings. When her dad found out, he went ape poop. He means ape shit. Turned into a whole legal thing. Turns out this richy rich guy just happened to have ties to the mob. Okay, so he grifted the wrong person. That's karma. Hey, come Straight on. Straight up karma. They caught up to me, of course. They tried to force me to pay, but more. Well, more than I could afford, so I snuck my way into Hope's Peak. Ah! You snuck in? The instant I leave school, they're gonna come for my guts. Black market organs are in huge demand, bro. I love my organs. I don't want to give them to anyone else. They don't do that when you're alive. Me. For the most part. Please. So you want one of my organs? Or sell me your identity. Those are pretty valuable. What the heck? This is ridiculous. You want me to sell you an organ? What? what? If he used the money to buy the artifacts, can't he just sell the artifacts on eBay for more money than what he bought them for and make a profit? And then pay off the mob and still have money left over for himself? What? You're not suggesting to sell my oop arts, are you? That makes the most sense, doesn't it? Just do it yourself. Don't be mean! No freaking way, that collection's all I have in life. How can you suggest such a terrible thing? You're cruel. How about that? 
I hate you. No matter what it takes, I'm gonna get out of here and even he's demolishing my life savings. Hey. And he has life savings he's not spending? To save himself from the mob? I figured if I sold one of your organs, I wouldn't have to dip into my retirement fund. Oh, it just gets worse and worse. He actually has the money to pay off his mob loans. He just doesn't want to spend it. He'd rather s sell one of my organs. You're no friend. What the heck? You're a freak. If you're not going to give me one of your organs or your identity, you can just get out. Well, is that the end of our friendship? Okay, well, I guess we'll, we'll call ourselves, we'll call us friends. Just so I never have to speak to him again. That was nuts. Wait, what day is this? Oh, three? Man, this thing got built way ahead of schedule. Ancient compendium. Yes, double the amount of humanity materials. Box cutter photo album. Five pi calculators. Uh, small light bulb, photo album box cutter. Okay, everybody, who's fired up? Two of you on cleaning duty. Box cutter. Oh, there. Triangle ruler. No, 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 wait. Oh my god. Everyone just go to Apple Land. Now, what the physics lab, yeah. Yeah, whatever. Fill up on stuff from there. Fat guy, you're the last one left. What was his name? Hifumi. He has five levels. I think I'm about to do number two. So there's three, there's four total I have to do. Coca-Cola potato chips. Coca-Cola. Mm -hmm. 
Would you like to learn about one of the many legends? What? <laughs> you don't become the ultimate fanfic creator without a few legends spreading around you. One such legend, in middle school, I was able to convince the school to create a fanfic. <laughs> no. From that day, I exposed myself and many of my fanfics to the world at large. For some reason, I like to suck and chew on my fingers a lot. Oh, these big sausage fingers of mine. Yes, indeed. You'll surely have heard about the highly acclaimed anime, Demon Angel Pretty Pudgy Princess. Mm. Mm. Hey, when he points at me, mm. his fingers are so chunk. I don't simply copy the pretty girl princess pickle style, I took total meta sci-fi approaches. My perspective has seemed quite odd, but if you really look at what I was doing... It was the total antithesis of the new wave sci-fi movement. I think it's just panty shots and waifus and uwu. That's usually what most fanfiction is. Yo! Oh, my, big, my geekdom is leaking out again. I apologize. So That's not your geekdom. That's something else leaking out. I saw it. Yick. I can't believe you were able to single-handedly persuade the school that you make a club. Mm -hmm. I bribed them with a cut of my profits. Yes, profits. <laughs> Clubs aren't supposed to make money. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I didn't think clubs were allowed to make money on stuff like this. Hmm. Opposite of what that is is when anything is allowed for any property. Banjam free for all special event. Banjam? Oh, I hate newbies. Oh, I fucked it up. Okay. Free for all? Okay. Got it in two. There are plenty of free for all events. More and more slackers are showing up with no idea what fanfic really means. It's so annoying. In order to crush those peons with all my mind, I'm going to start taking part in more free for alls. You should do that and talk to me less. How about that? I cannot forgive these lazy bastards. Wow. Playing any RPG with a villain spares the hero when he's level one. What happens? Boom, dead. Mm -hmm. The doggy dog industry, where only the most brutal survive. I think it's just. I think you're just overinflating it. It's just some nerd shit. I'm gonna start you off easy by getting you involved in some simple cosplay. I didn't agree to cosplay. Ah. You're a pretty good-looking guy. If your costume was decent enough, are you even... No, 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 yes, indeed. no, no, walking away, no. He almost made me a, a booth bitch. Sorry, booth babe. Yes, I know, day 11. Well, he's raring to go. Right, construct. Nothing ready to go yet. Got the photo albums. Need the box cutters. Box cutters, light bulbs, Venus flytrap. Cutters. Guess we can go here. Data center. No, the voice. One of them was like a... was it screwdriver? Middle plate. I 
I forget. I wish on this screen I could see how many of each I've got. Just for quick reference. Reference? That'll do. Go. Speed! Oh my god, what do we get? A little bit of everything. Actually got some light bulbs for a change, good. That's a lot. Back to Fatso. I'm coming. There you go. That noise he just made. That was gross. Okay, Coca Cola, potato chips. Potato chips. Makoto. Mm -hmm. What's wrong? Oh, I don't really want to know what's wrong. I'm gonna get snot on me. It hurts. He's sweaty. What kind of medicine do you need? Coke? Diet Coke? Bring me some Diet Coke right now! Okay. Are you like... Diabetic or something and need the sugar? I suppose... You've looked all over. I'm going through Diet Coke withdrawal. I actually gave him Coke as um, yesterday's gift. Present. <laughs> I think this is my fault. I'm gonna take over Monokuma's brain and use him to go get me some Diet Coke. Yeah, that's a that's a robot. I don't think you can use hypnosis on a robot. Nice try. Hmm. Say what? I would literally murder anyone in here for a can of Diet Coke. He keeps saying that. This is gonna go around in circles. You know nothing. This is like the Diet Coke cutscene. They didn't have to pay royalties? <laughs> Maybe they did. You don't understand the glory and splendor of Diet Coke. Diet Coke is a French all bad kind. Oh, he's drooling and sticking his finger in his mouth. Blah. A single sip and your body melts like butter. Mondo butter. Oh, yuck. <laughs> he's going through Diet Coke withdrawal. That's actually his storyline. So tired. <laughs> it's like and now he's having auditory hallucinations. Okay. Of Princess Piggles. This is embarrassing. Can't let Dark Coke beat you. You're right, I won't lose. I'm a strong boy. I can endure this for you, my princess. Oh, he thinks I'm Princess Piggles. I need to run. I need to run. 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 Called Code Mount Red Mountain Dew, bro. They couldn't afford Code Red Mountain Dew. The royalties are too expensive. They had to go with Diet Coke. <laughs> hey, Sakura. Oh, pictorial harness. Yes. Attendance record. Still need the Venus flytraps. Box cutters. Light bulbs. Oh, 
high calculator. When is this thing one day left? Fly trap, box cutter. Light bulb. Cutter light bulb. triangular rulers Demon Angel Princess figurine. Oh, I got heaps of those. <laughs> wow. Mr. N-Word. What's up? I feel like you're worthy of my trust. I wouldn't trust me. I've been making fun of you the entire time. <laughs> I've reached my limit. I need to get out of here right now. Are we going to your room? I need to see her. I need to get to a TV and see the real Princess Piggles. Oh no. By real, she mean a cartoon character? Without a doubt. Oh, no, Did nothing. I just make a mad? How dare you insult the princess like that? Say her name right, swine. You were just trying to be friends with me a second ago. Now you've just fucked it up. Um, it was demon. Actually, it's Demon Angel Pretty Pudgy Princess, to be precise. You left out the star, but I suppose I'll let that slide. You're supposed to say the star out loud? Oh, that's a terrible name. You really love that anime, mm -hmm. huh? Of course, she's my guiding angel. She opened my eyes to life. How oh, very sad. I didn't have a single friend. I was just a mind metal boy who liked to draw. Everything I touched, I hurt. I was a model young lad who fell to the dark side. No, you did not. You're not dark and mysterious and cool. I'm sure of it! Some hot girl would come up to the nice, weird, dorky kid, and I'd scream at her like, You're such a hypocrite. I'd just yell right in her face and make her cry. Man, I love doing that. Oh my god. It's okay, he dies in the main story anyway. 
I felt nothing but contempt for Pudgy Princess, and I thought it was just another magical girl anime. However, she came to me in dreams. <laughs> oh no. This is getting creepy. I don't want to know about your anime wet dreams. I dreamed I went on a date with lovely Princess Pickles. It was so much fun. When I woke up, I realized it was a dream, and I got depressed. Wow. Wow. However... In the show itself, the princess never falls in love. As much as I wanted to, I never got to see her face filled with love like I did in my dream. <laughs> so that's why it's I got into like... fan fiction. He was literally doing the self-insert fan fiction thing. Yes, indeed. Oh my god. I was consumed with passion. I finished one Princess Piggles project after another. <laughs> this is nuts. I was reborn as a true fanfic creator. I can't believe a top tier fanfic creator was worthy of admission to an elite school. Like, why was that a category? Ah. Uh. Hmm. I balled up all my love and affection, used it to do incredibly embarrassing things to her. Ew, gross. Ew, ew. <sighs> Still developing as a don't breathe like that while I'm reading this. I can keep developing her in all sorts of ways. I think we understand him good enough. Can we just you yeah, unlock the skill delusion? We sure did. Can we call that a Oh, I still have to go back and hang out with him more? No. I thought that would have been enough. There must be at least one more. All right, we're done. The concept is created. Hey, um... It's the Furby. And he hates it. Ta -da! The Cooking Mama. <laughs> I think the Cooking Mama was the first one I couldn't <laughs> actually finish. See? Gas burner, 10. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. It's already done. Done on day one. Nailed it. The Mona Lisa. That's done. Small light bulbs. Venus fly traps. Wow, we're really getting ahead of these things. It's not really going to be a challenge from now on, I think, which is good. <laughs> I don't even feel like it's worthy of the GGs at this point. It's almost like... It's the roguelike thing of once you get to a certain point, it just hands it to you. You've done enough grinding and it's, it's all just on a silver platter from now on. Small light bulb. Venus flytrap. Light bulb, Venus flytrap, whistle. Um, light bulb. Ah. Venus flytrap. Venus flytrap. Venus flytrap. Whistle? Oh, okay, it's Jim. Fill up on these. 
yeah, yeah, yeah. You can go there. That's fine. Just lost 40k. Oh shit. Once you start losing souls that are worth five digits or more, that's when the pain starts happening. That's the souls-like pain right there. Okay, this is going to be the last date for the report cards, I think. For all time. This must be the last fat guy. Hang out. And that's everybody done. Um, I'll just give him another demon angel princess figurine. Mr. N-word. It's kind of embarrassing, but there's something I told me to talk to you about. <laughs> you want to come to my room? I do not. There is nobody's room I want to be in alone with you the least. Oh my god. There's going to be sweat and Cheeto dust and B.O. everywhere. <laughs> and all the Princess Piggles posters. Welcome, Mr. N-Word, to my secret flower garden. You gonna talk to me about Princess Piggles? No one cares about her. What do you mean no one cares about her? You, that's all you've talked about every single time we've hung out. Oh, um... Maybe I misspoke. It's just that I don't have room to think about her right now. I was kind of starting to think about creating something original. Hmm. You mean like a real creator? Fanfic is amazing, don't get me wrong. It's a way to connect to people to a shared dream, so to speak. Mm -hmm. But I think I have more to offer. I'm ready for the challenge of creating the dream myself. If I could create something that might save someone the way Princess Here saved me, go. I want to create a masterpiece that will astound the mainstream audience. You should uh, be inspired by your fat sausage fingers. How about that? Make some kind of, like, sausage fairy main character. There you go. I want to create something other people want to make fanfic mm -hmm. of. Well, make sure it has a nice bum and big titties and it, it'll probably succeed. <laughs> I'll be cheering you on in private. Yeah, I don't want people to hear me cheering you on. Mr. N-Word, in private is unacceptable. Yes, indeed. Become my assistant. This is the second person that's asked me to become their assistant. After Mr. Uh, Byakugan egotistical prodigy kid. Hey bro, what's her assistant? I feel as if you'll be like my own personal narrator. Mm. Oh, I kind of am already. Mm. I'm sitting mm. here reading out your text boxes. <sighs> His grandpa went up to the mountain to cut and cut. Yeah. Grandpa spent days washing clothes, washing pants, all kinds of stuff. Here comes a giant peach down the river. Sell to the highest bidder. That rhymed, bars. Mm -hmm. I think he lost his uh, train of thought there. <laughs> I'll be counting on you to give the world a play-by-play -play as I send to Godhood. Ah. I will be leaving this room and you'll never see me again. We'll become friends, finally. Report card complete. Build in every page of every character's report card. Yay! Thank fucking Christ. That was a big one. Um, okay then. Now we can start on the easy stuff. The stuff we can speed run through dialogue. <laughs> and it's the weekly day off to get us kicked off. That's good. Uh... Okay. Who do we do? You know what? Junker's standing right next to me. Let's do Junker. 
Yeah. Hey, Junk. What you like to do? Dining hall. Uh, really? Dining hall? That's pretty boring. I did it? I cracked? What do you mean you cracked? Does that mean you gave up on Elden Ring? Hi, Junko. Um... Oh, no. I fucked up. I should have... Shit. I should have saved it. That's a point five. Damn it. Seriously? I should do the save and load trick so I can avoid the point fives. <laughs> but I really want a hamburger. It takes a lot of muscle to be a model. I have to keep my body nice and fit. <gasps> Makari, your face is all red. What could you possibly be thinking about? Uh, okay. We've done it. Those are so easy. A sub to Turbo? Is Turbo a person? Make lunch and go eat somewhere. That's the one. For real? That's not after. I'm totally looking forward to a homemade lunch. You're gonna make it for me, right? I don't really love or hate anything. I can just pack whatever you feel like. Mm. Okay. That was weird. That was a one heart date as well. <laughs> Didn't sound that positive. I give money to the mega corps so I don't have to deal with ads. Um, this is a school announcement. Oh, okay. I see what you mean. Oh. I'm um, I've got a sub to um, YouTube Premium. So when I'm on YouTube, I never get ads. <laughs> it's pretty good. Um, yes. Yes. High tech mop. Dust cloth. Just dust cloth. Areas of dust cloth, they're both hard. Um. I guess we'll start gathering watercolored paints for much later. Why not? Ooh. 
That's a lot of watercolor paints. that I'm going for Junko first is not because I just found out that by completing their storylines you uh, get given their undergarments. It might have contributed slightly but you just you happen to be staying the closest so that's my real reason. Sweet. That's all the tools built so I'm at my most efficient. Start pumping out these paint cans, 50 of them. Microchips. We can put the clones. days until something I have already completed well in advance. I guess everyone can have a massive cheat day. Everyone go to sleep. It's a crashes. <laughs> Getting a lot of good one heart hits with Junker.
keep getting the same one. For real? Which is actually good because it's the same one. Um, it's the one that gives me one heart, which is great. Good lucky streak. Four tree branches, Jesus Christ. This is great. <sighs> Get all the good stuff. Hey, Junker. Trip ticket, dining hall. Oh, wait. When I'm starving, it's burger time. There's the 0 0.5 again. Seriously? So, if I add that to the other 0 0.5 heart I got, that makes a full 1. So I can save scum it from now on so I don't get any more 0 0.5s. Check her relationship status. Day twenty. Oh, it's hand in this mana manakuma. Hey. The concept is moe moe. Is this the one I never completed? See, it might be. Secret Book of Poems, three. One, two, three. Boom, already built. <laughs> Second it appeared. Cray cray, all right. That was cool.
You got half of what you lost back? Half? How? Isn't it always- isn't it all gone? When that happens? got more off killing enemies that equals half of what you lost. That didn't take too long. Still annoying though. There's one, there's one combination of questions you get where is it hard being a model is the best answer to give. And I've never seen that one appear even once. Twenty-one, holiday. That's a double date day. How's she wait? Manakuma, how my hearts? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Three more. Well. Be 
the last Junko. Oh shit! The trigger happy thing. Negation to weak spot statement 2. gonna keep going still I'm actually kind of having fun feeling I'm so strange no it's wrong hmm. what other reason could there be why do you want to spend so much time with me anyway? Why don't you just face the truth? You live in a completely different world. What? Mm -hmm. Feels like being serious sometimes is a big important. deal. Just hurry up and tell me. This is worth one whole star, right? Come on. Whenever I'm with you, I feel like I don't have to be on. Mm -hmm. But still, when I talk like that, I don't think I'm annoying, do you? What? Aww. Well, whatever. Yeah. It's fun hanging out with you. That's all that matters now. Thank you. Thank you. Hot, please. Check our hearts. Yeah, she's there. Well, okay, let's get Celeste done then. I don't know how to do this one. I need to cheat sheet up. Cheat, 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 cheat. What, what, what? Where is her name? There it is. Uh, she's also dining hall. Boring. Nope. Off the best. God, that took th two reloads. <laughs> um. <laughs> Is
have enough tree branches. maybe. Get them here. And not tree branches, but watercolor paints. No, not that. Integrated circuit, bag of screws. Oh, no, music. Yep. Music. Six aluminum cans? What the fuck? Let's go better than that. is really good. It's the one. Yes, indeed. Now that that's two. Hands needed. Microchip. Twenty done. Forty one sci fi novels, that's good. Colored paints. Aluminum cans.
Wow, I keep getting the same one. What the fuck? Oh, damn. 52 watercolor paints, wow. That was a hell of a hole. Monochrome Adult. Isn't that I think Monochrome Adult is definitely one I've never managed to build before. Mm. 
five Greek statues. Power saw ten. Sand shield twenty. Cardboard. Cardboard and aluminum cans. Cardboard. No aluminum cans? What the fuck? How the hell is that possible? times in a row I got that breakfast one. That's convenient. Celeste going. Halfway. Five. Five more. Well. All good. That's it. Yes. Good, 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 good. Nice. That's six. Mm -hmm. 
This will be seven. Oh shit, it's one of these. Affirmation to statement two. It's now a good time for it, but just bring it up out of nowhere. Will you think I'm weird? C rank material, but after that, achieve my dream, reach my goals, hit my quota in life, stand by my side. The one. And the rest we've seen. Speed. Twenty nine. Five taste left. Stainless steel sheeting. Eight. Six, seven. I need more tambourines. Tambourines? Oh, Greek statues. Tambourines and aluminum cans. Insane. Tambourines, aluminum cans. What the fuck did you find a tambourine? Oh god, up there. Okay. I'm gonna need all of you to go after that tambourine. Tambourines, that's probably enough. It's number eight. Shit. Two in a row? This always happens. Fuck. I swear every time I get this answer, it happens twice. Always twice in a row. unreal. There's a new record. There's definitely a new record.
Yes, finally. Ah, <laughs> oh, the breakfast one. Sight for sore eyes. Right, that was eight. <laughs> um. Stainless steel. Adult. Nice. Now I just need more aluminum cans, please. Bank, 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 bank. Alright, aluminum cans. Aluminum cans. Level up to seven. Damn. Okay, if you're red, you go to computer room. Better source of living hands. Aluminum cans, yeah, okay, good enough, whatever. Why did I open that? is really good, that's the one. I feel as if no one cares. Back to 10. 50. Okay, we're ready for the big one. Way ahead of time. All trees are built. Oh, that looks good. That looks look good. Now I don't know what to spend his time on. Just stuff, I guess. Just double check the hearts in Celeste here. Make sure I'm not at 10 already. It should be 9. Now then. Yep, that's 9. Well. Wait. Never mind. Save. Yes, 
Okay. Yes, indeed. Go on. She's done. Let's do it! <laughs> Isn't that... See ya! Let's go Apple this time. I mean, physics lab. Sakura? Sakura is not one that's hard. It's always going to be a full heart. So that's good. Yep. Sakura is an easy one. Let's actually just save it in general. Where do you want to go? Oh, she goes shop. School store. Let's organize things in here a little. Yep. Of course. Good job. scavenge at this point, because what else are we going to do? At least free levels. Random as hell. Time for the Monokuma. Oh, wait. Well now. I guess I'll just pretend I didn't hear anything. So this Monokuma we built has a zip on its back? That's the plushy hey, mascot hey. suit. What exactly makes this adult? I got it! I know, you were thinking of some kind of adultish to have secret strength. It's totally an elementary school way of thinking. Aren't you guys all high school? Yes, indeed. Do it over. What are you gonna I don't think do? you'll ever like any of these. 
It's just a lost cause making these fucking robots for him. The heavy arms. Okay. I feel it. The heavy arms was a tough one. Never done it before. Um, gas burner, welder, microchip. Gas burner, welder. Is it 30? Integrated circuit. Lots of integrated circuits. And maybe some bags of screws. Integrated circuits. Oh, that's where they are, the computer room. Nice. Easy. You guys can go for more bag the screws, integrated circuits, circuits. Decent amount of integrated circuits. I'll be able to build this thing soon. Hello. Be good for training. I see one. Holiday. Yes, that means we're doing a double Sakura today. Welders. One, two. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirty, forty, fifty, sixty, seventy, eighty, nine, 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 twenty. So one of them. Circuits, bag of screws. 
Bonson burner. I'll leave more there. Oh my god, everyone's stoked today. How is everyone's energy so crazy good? It's 54 integrated circuits. Good head start. Whatever I might have to build next. Bunsen burner. Oh, there. Ah, everyone go Bunsen. In the physics lab. Wish I could move everybody's at once. Eight. Bunsen burner. Thank you. 
song gonna be well... nice. One more, one more Sakura. Then I've got three students lined up. Ten days. I can probably fit Let's one more it. in. Yeah, I think I can fit one more in. Bag of screws, tambourines, could use a. Tambourines. Yeah. One for you. Monokuma time. Ha! The fully functional chest cannon, this is what I'm talking about. Very Hell yeah, nice. it's every man's dream to have a total badass war machine at his disposal. We just built a normal Monokuma with a Gatling gun on its stomach. Now then. All right, let's open fire. The minute some people figure there's a flash of light, the cannon lets loose. Yeah. Back up the body got blown back by the force you of it. Guys. Damn it, you guys. Hey. You both got the thing for the stupid comedy routine, didn't you? Boom, boom. Do it over. Damn. What are you gonna do? You still got tickets. There's the Wallakuma. Ready? We're ready, ready Let's for that. Let's do it. Though. Ain't a biggie. Let's construct it right away. Boom. Now it doesn't matter what I set the task to. I'll just do the tiniest one. Just so they upgrade. Let's get the next upgrade. Let's see. Now the Toko, maybe? Toko. Okay. 
Well... What does she like? Library. Third place. Be dusty. Dusty old library. What should we do? Uh, I love reading. Thanks for the information. I have to say, taking something read in a book and turning it into a delusion is pure ecstasy. A delusion? I can take that delusion and use it to attack my manuscript. <laughs> and then she giggles ominously. Oh no. Um, she came. Okay, cool. <laughs> Where'd you learn those techniques anyway, you indecent boy? What techniques? What did I do? What's your problem? If you take me home and try anything there, I'll scream bloody murder. Okay, sure. Let's move it along there. Doko. Um, this. Holiday. All right. We're gonna get yes, two more tokos in right now. Came, she saw, she conquered. Sounds like something went right. Library. Uh, I love reading. I keep getting the same one. Where she orgasms and threatens me. Shit, one of these. Negate with statement two. Why? Why is Makoto spending more time with me? Does he have some kind of ulterior motive? You better not. Could be something else. I don't know. I don't understand. Did I just miss? Thank God. No, it's wrong. Let me just negate that. <clears throat> I don't think it's pointless at all, Toko. What the heck? You say us spending time together isn't pointless. What are you planning to do to me? I'm not planning to do anything. We want to both understand each other. I gotta learn more about Genocide Jack, too. That's don't don't, don't tell her that. She hates Genocide Jack. I don't know what you're trying to say. I don't want to depend on you. I don't want to understand each other better. Anyway. It's pointless. Okay. What are you... Fine, someday maybe you can show me, but... What is it you can do for me? Looks to me like she had a really good time. Are you sure? She looks super stressed. <laughs> it always ends with this, you're pretty good so far. Where'd you learn those techniques, <laughs> indecent boy? Like, are we hooking up in the library every single time we come here? And they just don't show it? Pinky library hookups? Well, that was three, with Toko. I think I'll get her locked in before the end, which means I'll have done four in one run through. I'm gonna just leave these as they are, because these aren't important anymore. Number four. Boom. I love 
reading. It's always the I love reading one. I haven't seen the other dialogues yet. Sandwich. Did you see them all? Oh, th no. Um, I'm just curious about the other dialogues. This, uh, the RNG has a chance of dropping three different groups of three options. So, and one of them is always the best option, which gives you one full heart. So if I get the three options that has the I love reading choice, then that's the one I have to pick. But there's... Two other groups of three, which have the options, do you read any fanfic, and do you write using a computer? Which are the other one heart um, dialogue choices. I just haven't had the other two groupings yet. Every single time I go, I always get the grouping that gives me the I love reading option. They don't mix them up either. It's always the same three dialogue choices together. So they're pretty predictable like that. You just have to keep an eye out for where the winning choice is out of the three. And you'll know which one it is immediately with the list. I like being done with the construction because I can just leave them all the same and just let this all just play out because this no longer matters. It speeds things up a lot. Go straight back to Turco. At least she's one of the simple dates where every single group of three is um, guaranteed to have one option that's a full one heart choice. Half the characters have that stupid thing where some of the groupings have nothing but 0.5 half a heart choice and then you have to save scum it to make sure you don't waste time. Just a pain. Like Celeste and Junko. Uh, Ryoko as well has that. Look, I love reading again. I think this is number 6 of 10 that I've done, and it's been the same one every time. What are the odds? down. You're too tired. And let's go. I think this is Toko number seven. I love reading again. This is nuts.
Oh, finally, something different. Uh, this is the do you write using a computer one. <laughs> if I had my way, I'd write all my stories with a fountain pen, but those aren't the times we live in anymore. I have to work with editors, and having everything digital is too convenient. <sighs> Since I don't have a computer in here, I finally started writing with a pen again. I've forgotten <laughs> how fun it is. The feeling of the pen tip gliding over the paper. It's incredible. Wow, okay. That was a pretty straightforward one. <laughs> she almost got turned in by the uh, the pen texture on the paper. Just barely. <laughs> Wait a minute. Personal effects. Ooh, I have cheat sheets. Ryoko is now eight. Cleaning maestros. Seven. Eight. Nice. Oh, I can probably... Wait a minute. I just realized I can construct... Consumables. Cheat sheet. Monokuma photo albums. Two level nine cleaners. That's amazing. Uh, need lots of Monokuma photo albums. Okay, let's actually do that because it'll help me if I do another, do another run through. Library. Everyone go to the library. It's very important. in there we only got six photo albums that one's a rare drop how's Turco looking we're very close to the end so if I was if I wanted to do this in I had the first run through, which was a bit of a fail, but I got most of the report cards done. Second run through is going to have four people done once I get Toko up there. That leaves ten people left, which means if I do two more run throughs and I get five people done each, I'll be done. Which probably will work because I got four done in this run through where I had to waste almost 20 days finishing off report cards so it only takes about 10 days to do a full person um, actually less because every seventh day on Sunday you get to have two free times so I can get five people done easy with probably some free times to spare to just waste and speed it up I can just if I can just choose not to use a free time day and just go straight to the next day okay 
Well, that's a, that's a plan. Wait, fuck. what was Toko's level? Eight or nine? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I thought it was higher than that. Okay. Well. Seven. So today will be eight. It's, uh, it's actually, uh, Genocide Jill, suddenly. Oh, this is the third one I haven't seen. Do you read any fanfic stuff? Yes! Stop asking stupid questions. A life without those little creations is a life of desolation. Without the festival circuit, the hearts of all humanity would have dried up and died forever ago. <laughs> Manic laughter. Uh -huh. It's super hard to get my hands on it and keep covered up so Miss Morose doesn't find it. So Genocide Jill loves fanfiction, and Toko hates it. So they have to hide their taste in literature from each other. That's kind of funny, actually. Like Hifumi? Yeah, Hifumi and Toko hate each other, but I guess Genocide um, Jill would have something in common with Hifumi. Okay. Wait. Struct. Zoomables. Chi Chi. One, two. Need one of more Monokuma albums. These upgrades are gonna suck on them thick and fast. Chi Chi. Sakura? Okay. I guess I'll leave everyone on this. You, you stop. Okay. Go! Oh. And 12 Monokuma albums. This will be not heart number nine. It's nothing new to see with her as well. Oh shit, this again. Uh, negate ooh, statement two. Holiday. Okay. Oh, we gotta actually. That's oh, already built. We're good. Have your Wallakuma. I actually managed to build every single Monokuma this time. And once again, he's not happy as usual. With my 200 bucks. Lobo, 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 lobo. Yes, indeed. Now then. Okay, meet with someone. We're on nine. This is well? the last Toko heart. And then I can skip the rest of the days. 
and just end this. done it's four spend some time alone let's just run that the clock run out the clock boys i think the next day is a holiday too so that's another two free times to run out time alone time alone Day 51. We're there. Good morning. Hi. Why well now. Phew. <laughs> same same shit as usual. Yeah, he's whinging about it again as usual. <laughs> Just give up. Um. I'm gonna have to lift the ban. <laughs> Looks like the carrot I put in front of you isn't working. Time to put a stick behind you. Talking about what a punishment? You guys deserve it, don't you? You didn't satisfy my request even a little Stop bit. I around. made all of your dolls. Trying to blame us, man. Yeah. My mind's made up. <laughs> From this point forward, each time you fail your project review, I'll select one of you to the class representative, and that person will be punished. And in other words, put it simply, it. execution. What? <laughs> this is different dialogue. I guess it's time I showed you who's boss. Ridiculous. You can't be serious. Well, what? What's the big deal? I just moved the schedule up a little bit. That's all. Huh? That part's secret. Now then. Let me just announce who will be punished this time. Huh? Of course. Didn't you hear me the first time? You got a cotton in your ears? Well now. Who should I pick? Yeah. <laughs> Maybe who he picks is based on who I romanced to level 10. That's why this is different. Today's punishment goes to... Yahoo! Makoto, you're up, big boy. Why am I punished? Hey, um... An average useless kid like you either dies first or turns out to be the main character. I was going to be the main character, actually. Oh no. Now then. I've prepared a very special punishment for Makoto, the ultimate lucky <laughs> student. Let's give it everything we've got. Hey, hey. Hold it. Huh? I won't let you. Who? <laughs> Toko? No fucking way. Oh, the robot speaking. <laughs> what is happening? What? What? Um... Oh my god, it's adorable. Huh? You heard our wishes and it's alive? What are you? I... I built an Usami. I built a lady, Monokuma. The amazing messenger from the future, magical miracle girl, Usami. What? What? Mifume, are you responsible for this? Listen here, Manakume, it's time to give up. Yeah, You're not supposed to show yourself yet. <laughs> if you make your entrance now, the timeline's gonna get all... Whoa. No questions allowed. Oh. Ooh. Future game thing from the sequel, right? Chibi Usa. We're fighting. So this must be the good ending. To the story Whoa. mode. Enough already! I won't let you... Well, this is fun. <laughs> Watching the bear and the bunny fight. For the coup de grace, the Osumi final splash. Yeah. Did you get him? Yeah, right in the belly button. It's a very fat belly button, too. I got it! 
Justice always prevails. Oh. <laughs> Hope you've learned your lesson, mister. Stop all this nonsense. Let's go. Does that mean I... Is this like a premature ending to the storyline? Just for this side mode? Monokuma handed something to Osama, left on wobbly legs. Huh? This is her origin story? I guess I'll see her in the next one of the next games in the future. What? What, what? what do we create, man? You. Good question. Right? I... I represent the bond you've all created. That's right! And that bond itself represents a fragment of hope. The light from each of you has overlapped, creating me, a road sign leading you for the future. Um... You did great, everyone. Now let's have a magical orgy. <laughs> magical? What are you thinking? With the power of rabbit magic, nobody can get pregnant. Hello! Or swap STDs. Wow, that's a, that's amazing. Uh... I love you, Asu Asami. Put your collective hands out, I have something for you. What you gave us was the same thing Monokuma had just given her. Oh. The device. Perhaps. I... Press the button and the door in the main hall opens wide. Wow, well, okay, we escaped immediately. Um... The story and I not even got a chance to start. Everyone lives. Let's do it! Yeah, boy! That's good. I am so happy. Ah, well, hello. It was a long, hard road. No, it wasn't. You do not know how long and hard the road was going to be if the storyline had actually kicked in. <laughs> I thought them. I won't forgive you. Why does she say that? Asami watched us celebrating a smile on her face. I had no idea what Asami really was, but one thing I did know was that she saved us. I wanted to make it a point to thank her. Give her cheek a little pinch. That's Go on. Right. Give it a little pinch. Little pink rabbit cheek. From this point on... <laughs> never mind. Um, Listen, everyone. All the time you spent together... Hello. All the time you spent building your hope, your bond, no matter what, don't lose <laughs> that. Don't give in despair, please. Yeah. <laughs> Just stopped. Mm. Ran out of batteries? Okay, we didn't build her that well then. <laughs> huh? She had no power supply? It was Christmas <laughs> magic! It's the magic of Saint Nicholas. <laughs> the enemy of your enemy is our friend. Hey, listen! Dope. Yeah! Let's get the hell out of here. <laughs> Alright, out we go. Or it comes back to life again, or Monokuma shows up. I turn back to Asami one more time. She had that stupid look on her face. Makoto. What is it? Hey. What Asami told us, the bond. It's a fragment of hope. However. What do you think she meant? It's a secret ending for level tening people, I think. Correct. Mm, <laughs> correct. To share a connection with another, it creates a light that dispels I darkness. See. That light illuminates the road to the future. Okay. Oh, I'm talking a lot of shit. <laughs> the more people you bring together, the brighter the fragment can shine. I think you're right. Okay. Before we arrived, each of us have a tiny little fragment scattered throughout the world. Each had something we were trying to carry within alone. We had no idea the consequences of the kind of thing led to despair every single time. That's what we learned while we were here, while we worked together hand in hand. All it takes is holding someone's hand in yours and that despair starts to fade. If it doesn't go away with two, then three. It's not enough, keep adding more. So make more friends. In short, TLDR, make friends. Ke uh, collect undies. Something wrong, Junko? No, oh, I'm fine. They just ruined our entire plan as all. Well. My sister's gonna be pissed. Is everyone gonna go their separate ways or stay in touch? Wait till you see the apocalypse outside. Hina. So it would seem. If it's sad for us to part ways, let's not part ways. <laughs> Should meet up every once in a while, take a look at the good Yay. old days. Yay! I see. They're you spending I mean. a lot of time talking about friendship right now. Yo. It's not like we're just gonna sit around and remember stuff about this place, right? <laughs> uh -huh. Let's get out of here. 
Back to the boring days, yeah. Fragment of hope within it, each of us buried in our hearts. Future born from the hope that might have moments of despair. Everything has to begin here. Woo! That was a lot. Maybe we should talk with everyone a little more. Oh, here we go. So the three that I got level 10, oh sorry, the four, are now standing here for me to talk to extra. So let's go Sakura. I decided to talk to Sakura one more time. Okay. Hmm. We've reached the end, but I can't say I'm totally satisfied. What do you mean? We're free. You'll never be able to continue your training, right? Of course. Indeed. I can feel the absence of strength I lost in here. I need to gain it all back again. I must now train even harder. Living here must have been really hard for However... Me. Not at all. It was uncomfortable at times, but my time here has given me another sort of strength. Oh, uh... Raw physical... No. Perseverance. Of course. That too, I suppose. It's larger than that. Okay, mental fortitude. Sorry. Of course. Right. You taught me the importance of withstanding difficulty. I'd never have come here if I'd... If I'd never come here, I'd met you. I never would have gained that kind of invisible strength. However... Not at all. I truly believe it. <laughs> before we leave, I want to talk to you about something. As I told you before, I've sworn to defeat Kinshiro. Prove that I'm the strongest human alive. That's why... Okay. Um, I think I read that you can technically do it in three runs, depending on how you set... Set it up. But I think four is probably a more likely... A more likely minimum. Um, this is why they require you to do all the reports, uh, the report card relationship scenes first before you get these. Because she's referring to stuff I learnt in the relationship scenes from the report cards. So it's like a proper fight finale to like all our relationship dialogue. Mm. Because that whole discussion about Kinshiro happened in the report stuff. And her learning um, mental fortitude from me. What did you learn? Oh, I didn't learn it. It was more... Well, I learned about Kinshiro. The man that she was in love with and couldn't defeat. And that he um, got that illness. So in the end he was defeated by disease. And she would never get a chance to do it. I would see him again. And then through the advice I gave her, she learned about mental fortitude. That strength is not just physical. Oh no, this is just Sakura's. Once I'm done talking to her, I have to talk to the other three that I just got level 10 hearts with. And then see what their wrap-ups are. Well... It would be meaning, if only for me. However... I want you to see me defeat him. He's still holding out hope that he didn't die from the illness out in the apocalypse. Little hope. <laughs> I want to put an end to the matter of my attraction to him. And then I ask you... So in the end... I can't talk about that yet, not until I'm finished with him. Hmm. Oh, I think she's attracted to me now, too. Can you grant me my wish? She replied with a, a shy I'm smile. Sorry. Thank you, Mikado, truly. The pleasant smile of a young girl. I can feel the strength of our bond. Unbreakable. I got her panties! Sakura's undergarments re received as a present. So was the final wish to, uh... Take her flower? In, as a matter of speaking? What? Is that what the getting the undergarments means? Oh, yes. Holy shit, can you imagine if I said no? All right, Toko. All right, these are the same. The blue dialogue is the same every time. Andushi. What's everyone so happy about? We're leaving. <laughs> but you stand there acting carefree like nothing's wrong. You're acting like everything's just fine. We didn't solve any of the mysteries here. Yeah, well, we also didn't all die. So there's that. You're gonna punish your novel too. 
Oh yeah, in her relationship scenes, I convinced her to write that novel. And I said it was good and dark. It's really good, everyone's gonna love it. Why are you getting so excited? I have no intention of publishing it. Come on, come on, babe. You can do it. Let me talk to Genocide Jill one last time. I don't know why you're acting so surprised. It's my story and my decision. There's no reason for you to be surprised or to care at all. Oh. I don't know what to say to her. We're friends? It's only natural for me to care and get excited. I did say something like that, didn't I? When you're in a slump, it's supposed to be your friends that cheer you up. If you're having trouble writing these stories, I'll cheer you up. <laughs> then help me right now. Oh my god, I am I am having sex with all of them. As one final hurrah. I'm gonna cheer her up right now. What do you want me to do? Silence. For now, I'm not going to publish the novel. Come on, let me finish, okay? I'm not gonna stop writing or anything, but... I'm not sure if I can write like I used to. Because of you, I'm losing the power of delusion. I can feel it going dark. Because of how much attention you've given me. I don't have time for delusions. I have to take responsibility for what you did. What am I supposed to do? Do you want me to come up with more delusions for you? Are you stupid? Why would I want any of your delusions? So what can I do? Well... Yes? Yes? Oh no, she's giggling and blushing. Stay with me and... Dot dot dot. Together we... Dot dot dot. Her eye touches fingers together. Just say it. I'm right about this. I'm asking you to be with me. Yep. All these endings are just complete fuckfests. I wonder if it's the same with the male characters. Like, if, if I do an ending with Mondo, do we shag and I get his undies? <laughs> do I need to spell it out for you? Would you want me to say it, demon? Yes. Talk dirty to me, Toko. Or bring out Genocide Jill. She'll do it. Even though I kept doing things wrong, saying the wrong things, you never ran away. I'm sure you'll say no if we stay together eventually. I'll stay with you, I promise. Oh my god. I'm here for you. Not just as a friend, but I'm a little embarrassed to actually say it out loud. Ooh. Then you don't have to say it. Some things don't need to be said. God damn, she giggles a lot. It's enough to have the thought in your heart, yeah. But still, I admit you made a promise and I'm not gonna forget. A promise to take your V-card? Okay. You really are a fool. Okay, I didn't forget what an eye novel is. You're distracting from what we're doing here. Are you gonna write about romance between us? <gasps> what, Makoto? Your disgusting delusions are completely prohibited. Is this acceptable? I put out my hand. She stared at it for a long time. I suppose. <laughs> this is how chapter one would end. I looked into her eyes and saw something I'd never seen before. The light of happiness. Nice. Got her panties! It's little white panties with a little black... Little black bow. It's hard to tell because it's pixelated, but... Interesting. Okay, Junko. I set up a good combination of characters here to do this with. Some of the more interesting ones. Okay, Junko. Is everything okay, Junko? Mm. Yeah, everything's fine. Why? And... You don't want to decide to come talk to me. You seem a bit different. She's still mad because it's not the real Junko and we've ruined her and her sister's plans. So there's a whole lot of other stuff going on in her brain right now. Hmm. Makoto, if I said that we should stay here together, what would you do? Should have did Hina instead of Celestia? Yeah, true. Big booby ending. And Don't worry about it, just tell me. Would you stay here with me? Why would I want to stay here? Oh, wait. Oh, 
Oh, she wanted to get away from modeling. Search for a new dream? That was, yeah, that was her story in the, the reports. Hmm. You're right. But when I think about it, the idea of chasing a dream is just too vague. There's no substance to it, no clue what it even means. You just end up desperate and lost, and then everything you've done is a waste. Before I find what I'm looking for, the world might come to an end or something. Aww. Oh, she really knows it has. It's just a silly metaphor. No, it's not. And you know it's not. Huh? It's okay to get lost. Blah, blah, blah. Why are you so scared? And... Scared of my sister. She's gonna kill me. Hmm. I mean, sure. I do want to believe, but there's something better waiting for me out there. So then. I have one more question. From this point on, no matter what happens, even if I don't see my myself, will you stay by my side? I'm having, like, final love sessions with, like, a bunch of people standing in a row. They're, like, taking a ticket, basically. To be my final lover. It's really awkward. They feel different from the Junko I'm used to talking to. Okay. Um, maybe she's dropping the charade of acting like Junko. She's being Makban for a change. You're the same girl I've known all along. Who else could you be? Well, she has to keep up the charade now. Yeah. It's okay, I think I get what you mean. But are you sure about all this? I've always been a disappointment, at least going to her. She referenced her sister, finally! Now I'm all alone, I don't know what to do from here on out. So what happened to the real Junko with this ending? Doesn't know that, Junko did it on a whim. I mean, her and her sister set this place up together, and then she got betrayed right in the opening. The, what she doesn't know is what happened to her sister with this ending, after um, Monokuma ran off from the Pink Rabbit. So now it's all over and she has to leave with us. If we get lost or run into trouble, we'll be together. I'd like that. <laughs> Thank you, Makoto. To look troubled. I huh? took her hand. Huh? She looked surprised. <laughs> when you look at me, when you feel your hand in mine, know that I am real. Oh no, she doesn't know Junko's gonna kill her. I was just saying that to her. I was saying to her, like, hey. And then I joked that... Uh, I joked that she knew that her sister was gonna kill her. As if she also knew the ending of the game like I did. That's all that was. It's almost as if there were two of her. She must have had a secret, one she can't tell me just yet. She'll tell me one day, now that we're in love. I'll never let go of her hand. Panties! Ooh, they're black. They're black and tiny. Okay, last one. For now. Celeste. Hello. You gonna go out into the wasteland and build your castle? Is that your plan? A black thong. Are yeah. you okay with this? Makoto, do you remember my dream? But to realize that dream, <laughs> I will allow you to give me all of yourself. Last things ready to begin. Oh, she wanted me to become her knight, her C-class knight. That's right. Oh. You do not have to play dumb. You do not have to pretend to be shy anymore. <laughs> From now on, you may serve me as my knight. I will grant you the opportunity to obtain true peace of mind. Go ahead, you may rejoice. Yay! I'm a slave. I'm a slave to a prissy goth chick. Well... How very modest. No. <laughs> I was celebrating. Let's see... By the way, we were very obvious to know the next generation after we leave this place. No. Do you? A nice quiet spring hotel. A European castle. I knew you would remember. You truly are worthy of serving as my knight. Perhaps it's time to consider promoting you to B rank. Oh, no one's ever been B rank. <laughs> in your eyes. What an honor. I'm still not good enough for A rank. <laughs> Naturally. However, you should not thank me just yet. Bear in mind, your promotion depends on the work you put in from this point forward. Okay. What work do I have to do? Massage your feet, bring your drinks. 
to collect beautiful butler bodyguards from around the world and dress them like vampires. I'll spend the rest of my life worshipping such beauty in my world of decadence. This is fine. Please begin making preparations. Let's I don't see. think it's possible to be Cel to Celeste equal in a relationship. It's very much going to be a her as the dominant thing, no matter who you are. Hmm. Indeed. With you standing next to me, I am certain. <laughs> All right. Remember, this is your master's dream. As such, you should consider your dream as well. <laughs> Let's depart onward, forward to the day we stand atop our castle together. Yay! I'm a slave. <laughs> I should have done here. Celeste's high expectations. I have to think hard about what I can do to live up to them. Or just half ass it. Who cares about her? Silly girl. Cool panties, though. Very frilly. I like it. That's everybody. For now. Too bad it's not like a... Yes. It's too bad they don't give you like a cutscene cutscene. Like a little movie of something happening. It's really just more dialogue. And then the panties. But some of them allude to actually hooking up. Like some of them do seem to have sex. Without explicitly stating it. But not all of them. Sakura and Toko seem to be... Um, very susly sexual. The other two, more just hand in hand. The beginnings of a lovey dovey thing. Who do I need to pee? What is it now? Seven thirty. Who? A lot of grindy shit going on with this. What's left? All gallery items. Uh, nine 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 coins complete all of the things that I'm doing right now with these little final dialogues and panties. That's the get all trophies achievement. Oh, that's it. It's the see all these little secret panty endings. Get 999 coins. Unlock all the gallery items with the coins and then after all after those 3 Collect every present possible, also with the coins, and then I get the collected every trophy achievement. That's pretty basic. Uh, all right, I think that's definitely enough for now. As far as this is concerned, I think it's a couple of hours of nap time before later tonight. I'll start a bit later, I think. And I'll just not stream for too long tonight. Just hang out for a little while, watch a few things. Well, that was cool. I wonder how many hours I've... Is there... Does the Microsoft Store actually tell you how many hours you've clocked? I wonder. Although I could count up my stream hours, that probably would tell me. Danganronpa? The time to beats. That doesn't help. What about on my profile? Is it there? Achievements. Danganrop. Time played two days and four hours and 41 minutes. So the hours clock into days if you go over 24. I don't like that. It's a hard to read. So it's 48 minutes. So it's 52 hours and 41 minutes. That I've played this game in the last five and a half days. Jesus Christ. And I'll put a couple more in just to speed grind out those last few. But those are boring. As far as um streaming goes. So things like the coins and buying all the presents and that are pretty straightforward. I'll just tie it up while watching a podcast and all that. Wow.
PlayStation doesn't convert to days. It'd be cool if they... Well, on the Xbox itself, it's probably different. This is just the um, Microsoft Store on the PC. This is a very different UI to what's on the actual Xbox. So I'm not sure what the Xbox does. I'll have to look at some point. Um, it feels like that was like a chunk of my life just then, playing Danganronpa. Like, ordeal's the wrong word, because that makes it sound like it was a bad thing. Um, that was a journey. That was a journey. I really lived and breathed that for a while there. It's gonna feel weird playing a new game when I stream again. My next gaming stream will probably be two or three days from now. A little bit of a break, so... I have no idea what I'm gonna play, but it's gonna feel weird not playing Danganronpa, because... <laughs> Feel like this is my life at the moment anyway it was fun hanging out genie i know we're still in the background but um time to pass out even though i'm still full of caffeine and sugar so it might be a challenge we'll see i'll have nightmares i'll fall asleep but i'll have weird nightmares possibly about this all right <laughs> i'll catch you later bye